everyone and welcome to another stream here on youtube.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. That's me. I'm Johnny Chiodini. Um, although apparently on Instagram and threads, the username Johnny Chiodini is already taken. As is Johnny underscore Chiodini. I don't, don't know why. There's another one of me out there and I'm going to find them and I'm going to ask them politely to give up their username so I can have a better handle on uh, social media. Anyway, today uh, we are... Returning to... Ret fuck! Why isn't that working? Oh, bollocks. We're returning to Return of the Obra Dinn, in theory. Once I swap an HDMI cable over. Fucking brilliant. Hold on. I knew there was something wrong. No, wait, is that fine? No, no it isn't. Hold on, everyone. What fun! Right, hopefully... Hopefully... Yeah, there we go. Right, so you're gonna... You've got visuals there, but no audio until I do this. Recording. Stereo mix. Properties. Listen. NVIDIA. There we go. Try and pull a fast one on me, computer. Fucking right. I'm up in the corner. You can see and hear Return of the Obra Din. We're ready to solve some mysteries, and I'm ready to read out the two super chats that I have queued up. Um, uh, let's see. Magic Chrysile, it's a good name. There's another super chat saying, Hello LSPs and lovely Johnny. I've not finished this game yet, so I'm VOD Squad to avoid spoilers. Have fun aboard the Obra brackets Chippy Din brackets Din. Obra Chippy Din Din. And may your timbers remain steadfastly unshivered. Thank you. I just shivered the shit out of my own timbers by uh, not swapping the HDMI cables over after recording the last episode of... Um, ba -ba 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 Ghost of Tsushima, which will be out on... Um, Saturday. Ducks piloting a mech Johnny. That's a weird username. Um, oh, I see. Has done a super chat saying, Hello everyone, hope you're all doing well. Had a great session of Vampire the Masquerade last night. And yes, the Ducks are now impersonating the glorious Chiodini. They have stolen your username. Usernames. Give them back, Ducks piloting a mech. There shouldn't be a mech Johnny. That's just a bad idea. Um... Aiden has done a super chat saying, I watched Nimona on Netflix. Such a good film. Ooh, I'd put it on my list, but unfortunately, um, not that I'm saying I was password sharing, but I can't access the, <laughs> I can't access the Netflix account that I was using anymore because I don't live at the address of the um, account holder. So I'll put it on a list for if I ever get Netflix. Dan has done a super chat. Dan's first ever super chat, in fact. Um, saying, hello Johnny, I just want to say thanks for providing a place to practice using they, them pronouns when talking about others while I watch your VODs. As someone with ADHD, new ideas are like holding a frog with buttered hands. Do frogs like butter? That's what I'd like to know. Um, you're very, very welcome, uh, Dan. Because th that's the thing, is practicing is a really good way of getting pronouns drilled into your head. Like, I've done it before where like a, a friend has changed pronouns and I'm like, alright, well, I'm just going to sit here and I'm going to Say, say, just, I'm going to just say a bunch of statements about that person until I get the pronouns, like, in my head. And it's, yeah, it's good. And, like, I understand it's, you know, especially if you've got ADHD and holding on to a new idea is like holding on to a buttered frog. Um, uh, I appreciate it's not always easy to get right every time. Uh, you know, like, I get it. As long as there's no malice in people misgendering me, it doesn't tend to really bother me. Um, so there we go. Um, ooh. Aaron Shaw has done a super chat saying, Since watching you play this last time, I've bought and 100%ed it. Thank you so much for the introduction. Oh, you're very welcome. Um, I cannot wait to um, 
to finish it up. Hopefully on stream today. We'll see how far we get. And Rack has done a super chat saying, Hi from a fellow NB in late night Australia. Thanks for the company. Excited for the return of the return. <laughs> Thanks, Rack. Well, with that, um, <laughs> Issy Mary says, Not to sound French or anything, but I could go for a buttered frog right now. I know, right? Um, right, let's get back to Oberdin. Uh-oh, which one is it? It's this one. Three hours, three minutes, with 12 fates solved. Okie dokie, then. So, previously on Return to the Oberdin... Din... 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 Um, we have done... How many fates have we done? Some. So, we know uh, Robert Whistler, the captain, uh, shot himself... William Huskett, the first mate, was shot by the captain. Um, Alfred Clestil, the bosun, was torn apart by a beast. James Wallace was decapitated by a beast, we think. Oh, look. Ooh. Um, Emil O'Farrell, the butcher from Ireland, was definitely speared by a beast. Uh, Edward Spratt, the artist, was crushed by a beast uh, while pooping, you may remember. Abigail Hoscott Whitterell was clubbed by a beast, which is to say she got hit in the head by a falling um, spar from the rigging. Uh, Nunzio Pasqua, the Italian passenger, was stabbed by very, very naughty second mate Edward Nichols, who then framed um, Hock Seng Lao, who was executed by the crew. Um, for doing crimes, allegedly, but he didn't commit the crime, did he? Um, let's see. Paul Moss was killed by a sword. Roderick Anderson was crushed by a cannon. Charles Hirschstick burned. Um, Nicholas Botterill was speared by a beast. Mabba the Topman was torn apart by a beast. Lars Linder was clubbed by one of the Nichols brothers. Nichols brothers? Peters brothers. One of the Peters brothers. Solomon Syed passed due to illness. Henry Brennan was uh, shanked by Captain Whitterell. There's a whole lot to, to catch up with here. But also, what's worrying me is, right, so, spear, oops, speared beast, one. Shot with a gun by A. Clestil, that's two. Decapitated by beast is three. So it should have said well done or not on those because when you fill in three correctly it, it updates them so i feel like the problem here is that hock seng lao was shot with a gun by alfred clestiel who's the bosun he wasn't really he was shot by a firing line so maybe what i should do is um actually pick somebody who we know is in the firing line. Henry Brennan. Let's say Henry Brennan did it. And then hopefully by Henry Henry hopefully then we'll get an update. That or I'm off on the other ones as well. But I feel pretty good about those. You know? I realise we've jumped in Really? Where, uh, Henry Brennan. Henry Bre Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Fucking yes! Well done! Nice. <sighs> cool. So, I realised... Um, I realised that... Uh, I, I, jump, I jumped straight in there at the deep end. Which is to say, the ocean. Um, for those of you who, have, who missed the last stream and haven't watched it... Oh, good luck. Good luck. Oh! Apparently if you go and look at the scene, his shot is the only one that hits... So he's the only one who could have uh, killed him. Basically, uh, this ship, the Oberdin, returned um, with nobody on it. I and my ship's manifest and my magic pocket watch have been sent to work out what happened to people by going back in time. You can see, for example, let's have a look at this. Captain, oh. Open your 
Oh! Uh oh. Exactly what I give you. And it gives you a little scene like this where we can see this man's being shot. He's been shot by the captain. And you get to run around and you get to look at the clues and you work out who is who, basically. So that's what it is. Andy V says, Is it Dracula? It's not. Although I am excited about the last... Vo is it The Last Void of the Demeter? The film coming up that's set in that bit of... Um, of... Um, b -b 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 Dracula. Um, right, so... Uh, yes, basically, the idea is we run around the ship, we look at all the memories, we try and work out who is who and what has happened. Um, and... Um, ah, I've not played this in a week, so I don't really know where we left off. So we're just going to have to keep titting about until we find more stuff to investigate. We kind of left it at a convenient point, it felt like, um, whereby there weren't any new things we discovered, so I think we just need to keep looking around. Um, Corvus Albright has done, ooh, a lock. Corvus Albright has done a superb chat. Um, oh, oh no, we've already done this bit. Corvus Albright super chat reads, first Obradin stream haiku for first Obradin stream haiku time. A new two point games? So, two point eldritch nonsense? Hashtag sarcasm. Very good. <gasps> this is new! This one! This one's new! Yes! Keep pressure here. Hold him down. Yeah. Uh, what madness is this? Sparta, etc., etc. Oh dear. He may yet find his senses. Oh dear. Iradora. Been in worse spots, I think. Where's the rest of his leg? Oh. Okay. So, one thing I forgot to mention. Um I'm gonna be hardline on this. I'm gonna be really hardline on this. Uh this week. Don't backseat. Don't offer anything. Like that was new, yes, but I found out for myself. Do not offer me any information. If I ask a question, it is rhetorical. If I'm like, is is this new, for instance, that's rhetorical. If I ask it in a French accent, or if I say I'm literally asking right now, then tell me. Don't it don't tell me that guy's Swedish, for example. Don't tell me anything. I will time people out. Like that's everyone's last warning now. It's like, so that is that is it. You'll be timed out. Done. Great. Alex Tannenbaum has done a super chat uh, saying, Hi Johnny, hope you're well. I'm at home with, oh, I'm at home with broken ribs. I tripped over my a-hole dog and fell on a picket fence. You and Morphine make it better. Bloody hell. Alex, that really sucks. I'm so sorry. I've never broken a rib, but I have torn an intercostal muscle, which is kind of similar, which bloody hell. Oofed. Um, that, that sounds rough. I'm glad you have morphine, and I really, really hope that, um, yeah, you, you recover swiftly. Fucking hell. Right, okay, so. Who's this now? That's the captain. That's presumably the steward who's being taken away. Clapped in irons. Identifying faces. Is that the bosun? Yes, it is. Who's this? The man who lost his leg and had a peg leg later. That's John. That, well, that will be John, but it is John. And then some fellows here. Dee 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 dee. And there's blood over there. And then this is... Thingy. Alright. I love this song. Um, Eleanor Smith has done a super chat saying, Curled up with a cat and a Johnny stream after a busy week. If I suddenly go quiet, I've just fallen asleep. I have not been killed by the captain. Understood, Eleanor. 
Understood. Okie dokie, unholy captives on the Caragal deck. Location of the corpse. Who is this? How did they die? Well, this is... Hang on. Oh, I guess... Now, two memories. First memory was... Oh, he was there. Okay, so maybe that's... Ah, fuck. No, I want to go... Shit. Unholy captives. Okie... Ah, oh, stop it, Johnny. Unholy... Ah, stop it, Johnny. There we go. Unholy captives we're going to. We want to see who is this and how did they die. Now, uh, keep pressure here. Hold him down. Okay. Hold him down. What man this is? This? 20 years, my steward, and never a doubt on your sanity. Explain yourself. Now, that might be the captain's steward. Um, so, we know we had them. Na, na, na. Lars Linder, the seaman, the man who was spiked. Oops, this guy. Fucking. Um, uh, da, 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 da. Aaron Paynes has done a super chat saying, I'm so happy to catch you live. Get a lot on VOD as I'm working from home. Thanks for being awesome. You've got me through my mum's death with your content and just being you. Please accept money for beer and Watson. Um, I will. I'm sorry to hear for your loss, but I'm very glad um, that I was able to help uh, in some regard. Um, uh, yeah, and I will... Well, I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll have a beer, but I'll also I'll get Watson some treats because she doesn't like booze and uh, shouldn't give beer to dogs. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for a, a, a really kind super chat. And I'm very glad that you were able to catch this one live. Who is this? Who's this now? Hmm. We'll have a look at that in a moment. Um, Brandon Hart is on a super chat saying, here's uh, some cheers for more solving mysteries and a hopeful appeasement of the blood pair. Let's see. We will see. We'll find out. Um, uh, I mean, I feel like the blood pair is not... It's always kind of waiting in the wings, especially for this particularly bloody video game. Rivendell Panda has done their first ever super chat. They probably have pandas in Rivendell, don't they? It seems like an elvish thing where they'd be like, and here we have some pandas. Um, it says, hi, Johnny and Skellies. I'm currently watching the first VOD, uh, vid the first stream on VOD, so I'll be watching this after. I was wondering if I could get a shout out for my godmother, uh, Nikaiba, for her birthday today with a present emoji and a bone emoji. Uh, absolutely, Nikaiba. Um, you like, you seem like a pretty legit godmother if Rivendell Panda is asking a, a dunce on YouTube to give you a shout out. Um, uh, happy birthday. I hope you have uh, many lovely gifts, um, including but possibly possibly not limited to a, a bone. I'm still thrown by that emoji. There's a present emoji and a bone emoji. But basically, basically, if bones are your thing, I hope you get as many of those as you would like for your birthday. If they're not your thing, I hope you get something else that's equally wonderful. Um, right. So... Let's see. Keep pressure here. Hold him down. What madness is this? Twenty years my steward and never a doubt on your sanity. Explain yourself. These ungodly beasts carry a curse. Throw, us, throw them back or doom us all. Tie him up and put him in the lazarette with those things. He may yet find his senses. Come on, you fools, he says in, it turns out, Swedish. All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. Where's the rest of his leg? So, what I want to know is... Who is this? Right. So this is a steward, you would think. Aha, so that's Philip Dahl, the captain's steward from Sweden. Because it was the captain who was telling him off then. Um, and this, th this man, Hyamya... We should be able to work out who he is now, allegedly. Apparently, it's very easy to guess, this one. Keep pressure here. I mean, it could be he's saying John to him. All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. Because the captain's called Edward, right? 
Robert, sorry. So we know, basically we know he bled to death, but... Before that he was torn apart. Now this is... Is this John Davies, the fourth mate? How many other Johns are there on board? Katrina Trigari is on a super chat saying, popping in to say hi between meetings and show my appreciation for more Johnny Return to the Obra Dinn. See you on VOD. I will catch you then. Uh, I mean, I, I will still be here because that's the way it needs to go in order for there to be a VOD for you to watch. But uh, I will see you then. John. John. So there's John Naples from Wales. But there's also John... D yeah, but John Davies is the fourth mate. And this man is not dressed like a mate. That is a seaman. Was torn apart by... I mean, I want to say a beast. Let's stick with that for now. And that's James Wallace. We know how he died. That is... Speared by Beast. We don't know who, though. And that is the Surgeon Henry Evans. Okie dokie. Here's the bosun. This is Unknown Main. Anyway, right. We've. I think we've got, we've got a good guess going on that one. But, oh, why didn't I check upstairs? Oh, Johnny, you absolute banana. Was he shot? There's a dead man here. Oh, crumbs. Goodness me. Okie dokie. Well, at least we're kind of back in the... Yes, yes, Vape Cloud. Show us the way. No, we're not back in that memory, are we? Damn. All right, Vape Cloud. I hate it when I miss stuff. Um, Chaos Goblin has done a super chat saying, Riding a high after passing my driving test on Tuesday. It took me a long time due to my anxiety, especially around cars. Thanks, Johnny, and all for providing somewhere calm before my lessons. Hi to Brenner. Hope all are well. Congratulations, Chaos Goblin. That is no small achievement. I never took my driving test. I actually stopped learning to drive uh, due to me developing like a se severe amount of anxiety around cars. Um, so, yeah, I can't say I blame you. Uh, right, what I want to do, actually, I'm going to go back to the leg. Where's the leg gone? Uh, I want to go back to that memory with the leg and explore the last bits. Um, yes, 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 yes. Pressure here, etc., etc. Who are you, then? That's... Oh, that's the butcher... That's our artist. That is the guy who lost the top of his head. Do we know who he is yet? No, we don't. Huh. There's a man there. Just like to know who all is here. Seems like an awful lot's going on in this one. What are they bringing down? <gasps> That's the thing! That's the thing that, um... That the, uh... Second mate was stealing from when he killed the Italian guy to cover up... His, uh, theft. Intriguing! Okie dokie. Fuzzy Murder Mitten says, That artist, I had to go back to his memory so many times and there's no way to skip the audio. <laughs> Indeed. And Orthogonal says, Can we refer to the artist by his real name? Uh, Mr. Died While Shitting, please. Of course. Where's the door for this one? They asked rhetorically. I'll find it and then I'll go through it. Of my own bloody accord. Do, 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 do. It's not this. Yes, it is. It's this way. Okie dokie. I was just curious. Curious about that one. This is... Oi, oi, oi. Right, so. Do, 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 do. Is this him? No, that's not him. There you are. Manam. Oof! 
Oof! Oh, that's bad. You were crushed, dear friend, I'm afraid. There's, there's expired shitting. Uh, as FW suggested, be his name. Okay. What the fuck is this, though? By a heavy object. There's our man who died shortly after. So many people have just... Oh, that really must have sucked. But what is in this package? It looks like a big... Looks like an enormous prawn tempura is what it looks like. <laughs> Cookie Cat 94 says it would have been quick at least. Yes. Eleanor Smith says, I know we're not backseating, but are we allowed to speculate, speculate about the wider plot? I'd rather you didn't, solely because it's kind of like when someone's like, oh, you'll never guess the twist in this film. It's like, well, I probably fucking will now because I, I know there's a twist, that kind of thing. Um, I'll leave it to your judgment, but I'd really rather... I was crushed. By cargo. Um, he's in four memories, is he? What's the first memory he's in? Hmm. Another? There is another? Okay, well, let's just gather the data points. Don't worry too much about getting everything right right now. You're gathering data points. Oh, are you dead? You dead? Yes, it looks like. Talman has done a super chat saying, bought this and spent hours playing it because of your last stream. Thanks for all you do. Thank you very much for the super chat and for the kind words, Talman. I'm glad you enjoyed Obra Dinn because, oh, it's bloody magnificent, isn't it? I'm following you, Vape Cloud, but I know exactly where we're going and it's here. You think you're funny, eh? Right. Doom, dum, dum, didding. The bodies? Watch your foot in. Hey there, what's this? Give him to me and I can fry a solid meal, boys. <laughs> Never know. Take it slow. Is that meant to be a Welsh accent? What's it, gentlemen? There's a free shell here. Let's have a look. No, get back. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, oh it was a giant prawn. And it still had some life in it. Who's that? I don't know. Right, you two are okay for the time being, but one of you's about to die. I mean, he was smashed in the face, wasn't he? He was, he was clubbed by a terrible beast. All for a pretty shell. Eh? Eh? Dreadful. Anyone else up here? Hello, friends. Ah, oh, there's too many of you to bother looking around for. Well, let's have a quick look, though. Throw the bodies over. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, that's one of the Formosan guards. Oh, it's really, 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 um... Ramping up, innit? Chris Bowen says, Jumbo Murder Shrimp. Okay, who is this? How did they die? Well, they were clubbed by a terrible beast. I wonder. Oh, wait, hang on. No, damn it. Clear the deck. Ah, here, the, what's this, boys? Give them to me and I can fry us a solid meal, boys. On tick, gentlemen, there's a pretty shell here. So, right. This unknown soul. It was probably Thomas Sefton, the cook. Yeah, Thomas Sefton, the cook. Was clubbed by a terrible beast while being a dickhead. Yep. 
that's there we go. That's how he died. Being a dickhead. Cheerful Spider is on a super chat saying, Happy Thursday, Johnny. You know, I've not, I've worked in insurance for years, but never been issued a magic death watch. Not even sure what department to ask. I'm not sure either, but you should start asking now and not stop until someone gives you one. A watch, that is. Um, because it's, you know, it's actually, this seems like quite harrowing work. Hmm. Okay. Who's next? Bong. Probably these two, eh? Hello, dead gents. Okie dokie. And we're vaping. And we're doing a vape trick. It's like a, a, a blueberry mint whirlwind that reveals corpses. It's like the latest thing. And zero uh, milligrams of nicotine as well, so like it's not habit forming. It's just like a, a super chill vape, you know, just like a super, it's like just bright flavors, like real good times. Well, now. What the hell is going on? What do you know about these things? About the chest and your dead friends? Oh, Christ alive. Oh, there's men in there's man in there though. Okay. The Mosin Guard was used as a human shield by that guy. There's the Capitan. Well, you've all died as well. Oh, God, your arm's gone. Oh, this is the lady. But they all were meant to disappear on the bloody boat. Apparently, that did not go well for them. Oh, thank God the goat lived, though, look. Narrow miss, but oh no, they both got skewered. Well, so much for the human shield element, hey. Lucky bosun, dodged that one. Okay, Christ alive. Michaela Hawkins has done a super chat saying, Life is a dumpster fire at the moment, and this is a perfect distraction to help keep me from either bursting into tears or having an anxiety attack. I will drink to that, Michaela Hawkins. Life is a dumpster fire at the moment. Uh... But I'm very glad uh, that this stream is uh, helping, helping uh, keep you grounded. Uh, this unknown soul was spiked by a terrible beast. This unknown soul was spiked by a terrible beast. Oops. Da -da -da -da. And we d we aren't supposed to know who this is. We apparently haven't got enough intel to know who this is. Who are you? You drive me bananas. This unknown soul. Okay. I'm curious. He's not Formosan. He could be. Is he our man from Sierra Leone? I think he might be, you know. Solely because I think he is the only I think he's the only black person depicted, right? And we're timing out Fingers Mahoney, aren't we? Just don't backseat. Oh wait, no, that guy was. Well, there we go. Yeah, you gave me some. Um, you gave me some intel. But let me make my own fucking mistakes, please. Unknown. Just let me make my own mistakes. Like it's okay. Just don't backseat. It's that simple. 
I'm having a really hard time at the minute outside of work, and uh, so my patience for that is just through the floor right now, just so you know. Okay. Uh, unholy captives. Right. Vape cloud, let's go. Naughty vape cloud. You know I can't follow you over the sea, vape cloud. How did this fellow die? Let's find out. Uh oh. Well, turns out someone didn't hold their fire. And it's that guard. Was there perhaps a motive for shooting second mate Edward Nichols? I'd say so. He's a piece of shit. He was shot by that guard who was spiked. Understood. It turns out we can follow the vape cloud out to sea. Who knew? Meanwhile, a horrifying corpse. A Formosan corpse. Another horrifying corpse. And some sort of shell? Dastardly. Aubrey Murray has done a super sticker of um, the Lime Child. Basically, if you imagine... Um, uh, if you imagine a lime is given little stubby arms and legs, such as, you know, we'll make it look like a child, um, and then give it some pom-poms and have it, like, do, like, a happy little march, that's what Aubrey Murray has put into chat. Uh, the lime child seems to be very happy with the murder of, uh, the second mate, who, in fairness, absolutely deserved it. Absolutely deserved it. Ellen Smith says, we are gathered here today because someone, looks at second mate, couldn't hold their fire. <laughs> uh, for Pete's sake, he's done a super chat saying you're a beacon for all of us LSPs. I can't offer much besides uh, merry money and virtual hugs, but I hope you're looking after yourself because you're freaking awesome. Thank you very much. That is very kind. Uh, Edward Nichols was shot with a gun by one of the foremost people. Who have all gone somewhere? It's uh, it wouldn't have been Hoxang Lao. Um, and I think that's Miss Lim. So it'll be one of these two, either passenger twenty four or twenty five. We will find out. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, Alex Simkin has done a super sticker. It's the blood pair, everybody. If you imagine a pair has been given arms and legs, uh, and also has a mug. A mug full of blood. Uh, blood for the blood pair, indeed. And then that, it's just delightfully, like, or delightedly sloshing it about, being like, I've got a mug of blood, look at me, it's a mug of blood. That's what we're looking at. Thank you very much, Alex Simkin. Emotional Support Viking has done a super chat saying, appreciate you and your content a ton, Johnny. Thank you, that is very kind. And thank you for your first ever super chat. That's very, very kind of you, thank you. Uh, Marissa J has done a super chat saying, It has finally stopped raining after 10 days. Bloody hell. Um, take this with my appreciation for being a ray of sunshine on grey days. Thank you. That is very, very nice of you. Oh, hang on a minute. Oh, I miss you. I did not see you there, my friend. You with your missing arm? Right. I mean, everyone really needed to calm down on this ship, I think. That's what I feel. Where's the vape cloud gone? Oh, you're fucking joking. Have I missed it? Where's it gone? Where are we off to, vape? Vape cloud? 
I never thought I'd miss that little son of a bitch. <laughs> Where's it gone? Is it... Oh, it's, it's here. Here he is. Right? Yeah, okay. Da dum Doesn't sound good. Please, give me a name. Give me a name, Miss Lim. Damn. There he is. Second mate. Prick. That's when he died. Due to only having one arm. Can we write that up as torn apart by a beast? Probably. That'll be Miss Lim. Have we already said that? Yeah. Okay. So we only... Right, so we got... Yeah, okay. This is not going well for anyone. But, mmm, treasure. Unfortunately, this guy is dead. Okay. Gosh. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Dum dum, bum bum, bum bum. The Indigo Witch says it's so inconsiderate that they aren't yelling out their names as they are being murdered. I know. Right. So, so. Are you there, Miss Lim? She wasn't. Whoops. Who is this? How did they die? I think we can assume that they were torn apart by a beast. I'm pretty sure that's what will have happened. We don't know who it is. We can't deduce with conf confidence just yet, but we've narrowed it down to one of two, which I'm all right with. Um, Stephen Burns has... Uh, <laughs> hang on one sec. Uh, Levator says, could everyone please promise that in the event of your murder, you could just yell out your name and job, please? I'll try. Ah, Johnny Kidini. And I I mean, it's tricky because I guess YouTuber would be the ow, the most appropriate term, but I still like to think of myself as a journalist. <laughs> to be honest, the name would probably give you enough. There aren't that many. There aren't that many of us out there. Oh, although apparently enough that I can't get a good username on threads or Instagram. But there we go. Um... Stephen Burns has done a super chat, a super sticker. It's the blood pair again, <laughs> because again, lots and lots and lots and lots of blood being spilled here. So the blood pair is absolutely raking it in. Just really enjoying. One other person was present. Uh, the corpse was moved post mortem on the open sea. Um, bong. Okay, now Miss Lim, we know who you are, so I'm really counting on you to yell out his name. Because a buddy system is also fine. A buddy system is 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 great. And vape. Whoa, that's such a neat vape trick. Whoa, wild. Wraith Finds, it's still such a great username, has done Super Chat saying, Yay, more murder! I'll catch up on all the viscera and squishy sound effects tonight on VOD. Have fun, Johnny. Thank you, Wraith Finds. I intend to. Uh, Ethan Miguel Serkey has done a. S that sounds bad. What's his name? What's his name? Oh, Christ. Um, oh, Christ. Oh, God. We'll pause that. Ethan Miguel Serki is on the Super Chat saying, Google says Johnny Chiodini is a TV personality. I'm not sure that's a, really applicable. I've, I have been on television, like, I think once. T twice. I've been on television twice. But I wouldn't say that... Three times. Three times. 
been on television three times, but that does not make me a television personality, I hasten to add. Um, Rack has done a super chat saying, oops, sometimes I get too anxious watching things live. We'll catch up on VOD. Have fun and good luck, Johnny, and a good night to the rest of the Aussies. Take care, Rack. Um, sleep well, and I hope you feel uh, less anxious very, very soon. Um, do take care of yourself. And uh, yeah, thank you for the super chats and just for generally being lovely in chat. Thank you. Will says, internet dickhead. Thank you. Yes, there we are. Internet dickhead, Johnny Chiarini. Okay, so, would it appear, these things appear to be having a very bad day, and it seems, oh Christ, hey, you've been speared, I and mean, we'll find out about you in a bit. Ah, that's, uh, oh, that's how he lost his arm, I guess. Okay, I guess he was torn apart. Now, I'm going to assume that this thing is sucking their souls out rather than putting their souls back. Because they seem to be not enjoying this treatment. At all. I shouldn't zoom in too closely on that because that creature has multiple sets of tits and I don't want to be demonetized. Oh, so does that one. Uh, you're making it worse, Johnny. Um, hmm... Yeah, I'm going to say, down to all of the already dead people, that that is killing them rather than reviving them. We'll see, basically. <sighs> nice which says, hello skellies, I'm on bus mode. Going to be in pyjama mode the moment I get home. I hope you're driving. Well, I guess she was... Oops. She was... Claw I think she was clawed by a terrible... Oops, no. No. Cl no. Clawed by a terrible beast. Because she had claw marks on her face, right? Hmm. Jupiter Mon says multiple sets of tits is what could get the stream demonetized, but not all the horrible death and murder. I reckon, yeah. I reckon. I've had some weird reasons for being demonetized in the past. Um... What was there was a really weird one recently. I think it might have been when I streamed Sea of Thieves or something, and I'm like, is it because I sang a recognizable song? Like I don't really understand. But anyway. Uh so Bun Lan Bun Lan Lim, I think was clawed by a terrible beast. Why didn't he say his own name? Why didn't Bun Lam Lim say his name? Let's just have another look at her, just to be very... Yeah, those are claw marks, right? She was... yeah, she was all clawed up. Okay, who's next? Just so much death. Oh, it's you. Sorry, I didn't see you there. Names. 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 We like na Okay, so this guy was grated. That uh, looks like a cheese grater anyway. Okay, so we know Nichols is oh Nichols is the second mate. Ah ferocious lady. This guy was definitely speared. Uh, this one was... Oh, that's a hand dragging him over. Oh! Yes, yeah, she was clawed. Well, she was kind of bitten as well. I think it was probably the bite that did her in. This guy was speared. Okay. Lots to take in here, including this continuing struggle. Okie dokie. We're just collecting data points. We don't have to get everything. I don't have to get everything sorted immediately. It's okay. All right. Okie dokie. Who was this and how did they die? I'm not even sure which one it was. Oh, he was Irish. 
Oh, Hagen, are you still breathing? Can you row? Nickel sh sir, shoot him for God's sake. I need to see which one he was. It wasn't that one. I think it's the one being... I think it's the one being tackled. Yeah. So he's being... I mean, it's not that clear. It's been sort of aggressively wrestled by the elderly Formosan gent. So who was this and how did they die? We know he's Irish. Is it O'Hannigan? No. No. O'Hagan, oh, are you still breathing? Right, but he says sir, so we know that he's not senior, this unknown soul. Right, he's definitely Irish. Patrick O'Hagan is Irish, but... Ah. Aha. There's a second... Ah, it's the steward. If he's talking to Nichols, who is the piece of shit second mate, that makes sense that that's his steward. Because he speaks with an Irish accent. There's only one other Irish person on board, and that's O'Hagan, but he, re he refers to him specifically. So Samuel Gallagher was. I mean... Strangled? We'll say strangled for now. We're going to have to go back to this one anyway to put in the name once we work out which of the two unidentified Formosan men is which. So that will be okay. All right. Anna says, imagine having to steward for Nichols. I know, right? Hello, uh, Galligan. I've just stabbed this um, Italian man in uh, the hold. But... Um I'm framing this man here. I need you to back me up so we can shoot him. Dreadful business. Awful, really. I mean, is that really his dying moment? He's not being strangled either. And he might, it sort of is. How did you die? I think I can guess, actually. Keep rowing! Bang! We've got a name! Fucking hell! That's fairly cut and dry, isn't it? Womp! Oh, there's that guy. Yep, we know, we know how you die. Fuck, it's just so many dead people. <gasps> look, look, that's how he got free. That's how he got free. He was able to cut his bonds on the spear. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. I mean, if that's O'Hagan, I'd say no, he is not well enough to row. <laughs> but this might well be O'Hagan. Patrick O'Hagan. We don't know for sure. And we're not sure who this is either. This could be O'Hagan. <sighs> well, criminy. There you are, Nichols, you POS. Oh, there's another bit of tempura. Okay. Ah, oh, fucking. Give us a weapon. S sounds relatively Irish. Um. Bang, bang. Fucking right. So hang on a minute. No, hold on, hold on. No, it's not gonna be that. Uh. uh, 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 uh.
Your name is Bang, I'm pretty certain. Da 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 da. It bangs ya. Okay. Which is. I'm sorry, sorry for your loss and everything. But that means we can now name. This fellow. Surely. Because. Come. Damn it. Damn the UI. Depicted in Formosan royalty sketch. Right. He's the only one we haven't identified. So, we know that that is Cho Tan. Right. Now that is interesting though, because uh, Q table of contents, and then it is So is it Souls of the Sea? For fuck's sake, I hate when I do that. Ah. On the cargo deck, the doom. No, where's it gone? We don't know how you died, do we? It's I said torn apart by a terrible beast. But it's not given us that. We know who he is. And it looked like he was torn apart by a terrible beast, owing to the fact that he was missing an arm. I guess we'll just we'll see a bit later. Ah, oh, Calamity Janine says, hopping backwards to VOD Squad from the beginning, but I wanted to let Johnny know they have joined a rarefied category, which is YouTube as my dog will settle down and be calmed by LOL. That is a tremendous honour, if you ask me. Thank you very much. Right, let's have a look at this. Uh, and the Wandering Weird has done a super chat saying, this is the worst singles cruise ever. I know, right? Dreadful. Three days? You packed enough stores? Aye, sir. Checked and loaded them myself. Good. Stay quiet and alert. If the wind picks up, we've no chance against the overdeck. Mm. Shoot ya! Be one trouble! I shut it off! This is strange things! Above monsters! Oh fucking hell! No fooling! They did say strange things about monsters. Am I, I'm, allegedly, I can work out who this is, but we'll see. Okie dokie, yeah, that's how it started. They were playing to row for three days to the Canaries. Nichols, you are a real asshole. But, honestly, a bloody good dodge there. Really good dodge. Yeah, oh, no, don't. Don't show us them. Just good throw, in fairness. Dum, dum, dum. Would that technically make this uh, a sea to air missile? She's technically a submarine. Bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Okie dokie, you got speared by a terrible beast, and allegedly we can work out who you are. But there are there are four people on the list who are a topman from China. Which makes it quite difficult. 
Wait, no, we want to go back in. No! No, 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 no! Okay. Uh, keep course due east. They stray, say strange things about monsters. Yes, okay. Right, I said checked and loaded on myself. I just really want to nail down who Patrick is. But it still could be one of these two. Yeah, it could be either. Oh, fuck, there are... Yeah, no, it could... Yeah, Patrick O'Hagan. Uh, I don't know which one's which. Okay. <laughs> Anna says, someone mod a stream-friendly version that adds shell bras. <laughs> uh, very good. Okay. And you, sir, are difficult to identify. We know that you are Russian. Russian to the Canary Islands, am I right? But that could make you Leonid Volkov... Alarkas Nikishin or Alexei Toporov. And I just don't know which one's a which. <sighs> I think this is about as far as I got when I tried to play through this in 2019. So I'm excited to get more confused. <laughs> Yella suggests uh, algae crop tops. Amazing. Okie dokie. Conclusion. Two wayward souls disappeared during the events of this chapter. Their fates are catalogued here. I don't know. Do you have a paper notebook to note stuff in? I've got this envelope, which has... It's, currently it's just got a note about the Peters brothers. <sighs> Okie dokie. We'll try and work this out. This is a lot, isn't it? I'll have another look. I mean, basically, his arm burnt. Burned? Oh, he burned. He burned to death. Look. Right. Let's have a crack at this again, then. You burned to death. Because that looks a lot like fire. And that looks like a, a lot like fire. And then he had no meat on his arm. I'm going to say it's that. Ooh. Calamity Janine says, uh, Belated follow-up. We both appreciate you not making any sudden beepy noises, her more so than me. You're very welcome. Okay. Just going to keep looking. Just going to keep having a little look. Oh, perfect. I have treasure. I yield. Hold your fire. Well, we now know who this is. That's Chotan. So, we can now conclude that Nichols was shot by Chotan. Oh, no, 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 no. Shot with a gun by Chotan. Cool. And then we can go through this one. Ugh. Yep, yep, yep. You were having a terrible time. Ah, now... We know for a fact that... The others... We know, we know for a fact the others were pulled overboard. The disappearances, they were pulled overboard. Because we saw it happening. We saw at least one of it happening. No! Right? I'm pretty sure. Let's go back to Miss... Okay. 
Hmm. Okay. That's right. They all... Right. And we know you were speared by a beast. Right. And we know that you were... Oh. Well, I'm going to say you were strangled by... Oh, wait. We should have a look at your corpse. Are you... Ah, you were stabbed. Stab, stab. Stab, stab, stabbed. <laughs> Shouldn't be that cheerful about it, should I? Was stabbed. Was uh, knifed. By. Bun. No, bang. Fucking yes! Yes, he did. Mm. Bum, bum. Fucking yes. Not even halfway. <laughs> Table of contents. Right. Um... Was all of this... No, this wasn't in the Doom, was it? I want to see those disappearances. Just show me those disappearances. Disappearances. Yes, okay. I'm just going to say was drowned. By Beast. Oh, oh, yeah, whoop. Fuck. And I'm going to say the same for you. Even though I'm not sure... That they both were. I saw that one of them was. So we'll see. In fact... Right, we want to go for this one. Hagen, you still breathe and can you row? Nickel shirt, sir, shoot them. For God's sake. Because that one... Okay. Ah, so, Galligan, Galligan, Galligan. There he is. Right, that's the me memory we need to access now. Okay. So, we need someone who's hurt and at the oars, and that's O'Hagan. O'Hagan, you're still breathing? Can you roll? Nichols, sir, shoot them for God's sake! Okay. All right, so, we know that this is when knife happen. Oh yeah, look, the knife is there, I just didn't see it before. And he's talking to... Oh, I mean, right, no, you speak Chinese. Are you still breathing? Oh. I think that's O'Hagan. Because this guy is clearly still breathing but has other shit going on. I'm going to say that is O'Hagan. And he looks fairly run through, right? Let's have a look at his. I could be wrong here. Yes, all right. Okay. Yes, I think we I think we know. What how did I not fill that in before? Was speared by a beast. And I'm pretty sure that's O'Hagan. Then who would you be? This unknown soul. Right. Six memories. 
first memory. He was in the room when Syed succumbed to a tragic illness, which is on the all-up deck next to the surgery. I kind of want to go see that one, because I want to see what company he keeps. I could basically... I mean, we've definitely filled in something useful because this guy was speared by a terrible beast. Personally, I think it's O'Hagan. But I could be wrong. Either way, we know this guy was drowned by a terrible beast. We know that to be true because we saw it already in the next one. Um, all right. Good. All right. Uh, Timothy Thomas has done a super chat saying, Hey, Johnny, sorry it's been a while since last super chat. Do not worry at all. It's it's always a treat, but never expect it. Um, my life finally feels like it's coming together. Now I have my own place and some life balance. Just know when it was hard times, your videos kept me sane. I'm very, I'm very pleased to have helped, but moreover, I am very pleased that things are coming together for you. That is absolutely delightful news. Um, many, many congratulations. Um, and I long may that sense continue. Frankly, is this the all up deck? No. Which one's the all up? Ah, it's the one below this one. So this is the gun deck. This is the all up deck. It's a little bit busy now, but hello! This is what we want. Okie dokie. So. That's not the man we're after. <laughs> you are Russian. You are Russian. Well, that means that we are correct about Patrick O'Hagan. And I wonder, I wonder. I suppose technically he could be Polish. Now, these are all seamen, not topmen. These are the topmen. No, so it says me when I see a guy hurrying. Ha ha, you are Russian. God damn it. <laughs> okay, yes. All right, could we have a guess at who you are? Let's see. No. Alarkas, Nikishin, and Alexei Toporov both fit the bill here. And you are... Oh, it's re this, this one's annoying me because he looks like a man with whom I used to work who was an absolute tool. Like a real POS. Uh, to the point where actually I'm going to send a snarky message to a friend. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, lol. And then the name of the person I think it is. Right. Okay. Bristolian stag beetle says Michael Whelan. No. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I mean, that's another murder that's been committed on the Obra Dinn. Fucking hell, Bristolian stag beetle. Uh, Darth Monk. Hey, Darth Monk. How are you doing? Um, Darth Monk's on a super chat saying, just tuning in to say hi to my favourite streamer before going back to waiting for the VOD so I can't backseat. Oh, that's very kind. Thank you very much. Uh, it's good to see you. I hope you're keeping well. All right, okay. Solomon Syed. Who's this? Oh, 47. What? 47? Very good, 47. What does that say? Uh, da, da, da. That's impossible to read. But who's number 47? Very good, 47. That's Alexei Toporov's bunk. Pipe! 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 
He's got a fucking pipe. Yes! 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 Fucking yes, we know who he is. Fucking yes. Which one was he, though? <laughs> In the memory. Pipe, 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 pipe. You've got a fucking pipe. Get me out of this goddamn memory, assholes. Fucking yes. Mm. Get me back on that bloody lifeboat. Not life. Yeah, the bloody lifeboats. Number 47 smokes a pipe. Let's just double check which one he is. Da 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 Will says, please stop talking about the Siemens pipe. Absolutely not. This is my stream and I'll talk about Siemens pipe as much as I want. Ah, fuck, he's not in this one. <laughs> fuck. Uh, we need an earlier one. Let's have this one. Hello. Can we? No, we can't access yours. Oh, they're all chained, aren't they? There we go. Oh, I'm having a lovely time. Dum dum dum, bum bum bum, bum bum bum, bum bum bum, ba da ba, ba 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 ba. Where's your pipe? Right, that is number forty-seven. That is absolutely number forty-seven. I'm convinced. Alexei Toporov, you drowned. I think. Hang on, wait. Let's check the other boat. No, there you are. You're not Alexei Toporov at all. How dare you? How dare you? You're unknown, actually. You, sir. You, my friend, are Alexei Toporov. Would have been a lovely time there to get the old, um, bottle dom, dom, well done thing, but that's okay. <sighs> oh, that felt very good. Oh, that felt great. That felt great. Ah, <sighs> but who are you? All we know is that you are Chinese. Or that you speak Chinese. Oh. Oh. Oh, that felt tremendous. Uh, hello. Crushed by cannon. Uh, this one's still bothering me. Bec <laughs> nice, which says, well done on being excellent at locating pipe. Thank you. I give big cub energy. <clears throat> right. The, what pisses me off about this one is that I can't see the man being pulled overboard. But I know he is there. Let me in! Right. Oh, Okie dokie. Right. Hmm. So the problem is, we're now a little bit in the weeds. Because, goodness me, we've got a lot of memories here, but we've now reached the end of, like, a run of them. And there's so much, so much, left to see. Not loads, loads, actually. God, I wish I knew who all of these fates were and what befell them. That would be lovely. Will says, we're not in the weeds, we're in the boat. Damn it. I need to locate some more memories. Not memories, we've seen enough of those already from the mermaids. Let's just reacquaint ourselves with them. Um, some of this. Yes, that's right. You were spearhead. Do we know who you are yet? Yeah, Nicholas. Oh, old Nicky Bottrill. 
And we know who you are. It's kind of just having a peek now. Ah, the goat. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> and who the fuck are you? Oh! Well... Actually... You might be our man from Sierra Leone. Because you are sat with... Oh no, but that, that was a seaman. Hmm... You were sat with. I thought these were top men. You know what? Let's remove that just in case. Bum 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 bum. There's lots of stuff we've already sort of explored. I'm going to say something in a French accent now because I'm going to legitimately ask a question of chat. So this is one of the times where you can answer a question and I'm being sincere. It is posed to chat. Please tell me. Um, if anybody knows where I can pick up a new memory that I have not yet found, uh, that would be great. Thank you. Because I'd like for the pocket watch to go boo 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 bit of cargo deck, says everyone. Alright, thanks. Thank you, everyone. There's an entry in the book that is circled, says Retro 111. Oh, on the cargo deck. Oh, right, yeah, okay. Understood, thanks. Okay. Uh, now, we go back to not telling me anything. It's such an elegant system. Well, says all... Nope! Well, thanks for joining me, everyone, but fuck that. Absolutely not. No, get me off the ship. Uh, Will's, uh, Will says, no, it doesn't cargo road. Very good. Uh, and Jay Appleseed has done a super chat saying, Pig Tax just got off work, so VOD Squad, but wanted to say I think you're awesome and thanks for waiting a week to stream this again with us. You're welcome. I really wanted to keep playing this, but I haven't. Let's find out how this little crabbo died. Little Crabbington. Oh, goodness me. Um, but yeah, no, thank you, Jay Appleseed. Um, and I will see you in VOD Squad. Uh, in fact, if you're watching this in VOD Squad now, hello again! Uh, it's very nice to be streaming this again, uh, and just to be streaming video games in general, um, which actually is a good point to, to bring it up, probably. I am going to, for the time being, start streaming video games on Monday as well as Thursday, whereas normally Mondays I reserve for painting. Uh, and I know that people do enjoy the painting streams, so do I. I think they're wonderful. I have a really good time painting. I always say, oh, it's nice to be painting, etc., etc., etc. However, um, because there's not like a video game for us to focus on, which, you know, provides just like something for me to fall back on in terms of giving commentary and stuff for us all to talk about and make jokes about, etc., etc., I have to going. OBS apparently dropped for a second there, but it was momentary. So hopefully you didn't miss any of that. If you did, just let me know sort of uh, where it dropped off and picked up again. Um, but basically, um, yeah, there was a bit of a drop, but we're back, seemingly. Um, Okie dokie. Uh, yeah, basically, I have to work quite a lot harder to keep the chat going and to keep everything feeling, you know, like fun and bouncy and to keep everyone engaged and not feel like I'm just yelling into a void and at the moment that's quite hard for me so um, I'm gonna take a little sort of painting break and do some just do some uh, do some basically an additional video game stream a week um, I will come back to painting because I love it and it's a very good hobby of mine but um, 
Yeah. Someone says, please open look sensitivity. All right. <laughs> a parody of control. Unreasonably fast, reasonably fast. Fast side of perfect, perfect. Slow side of perfect, just slow. Struggleish, nearly motionless. Absolutely wonderful. Uh, but yeah. Uh, that's that's that news. I'll put out a post about it in the YouTube community tab because we all know Twitter's dying on its ass. Incidentally, I'm on threads um, if anyone's into that. And I don't have a Blue Sky invite, but uh, yeah, that's the thing. Um, Okie dokie. Levi Vaughn has done their first ever super chat, in fact, saying, Hi, Johnny. Um, your videos have helped me get through unemployment as I dig my way out of corporate life, and now I've got an opportunity to work at my regional theatre. Th thank you for creating this amazing space and being yourself. Um, the sound is clipping on and off again. That's weird. Um, huh. It's cutting off every other word for me at the minute. Could everyone maybe refresh? Try refreshing if you can um so uh, just in case leave over on some super chat saying hi johnny your videos have helped me get through unemployment as i dig my my way out of corporate life and now i've gotten an opportunity to work at my regional theater thank you for creating this amazing space and being yourself congratulations um genuinely like uh like congratulations on getting out of corporate life and working at your regional theater sounds like such a lovely uh, a lovely change um so, yeah, um, I'm very glad to have uh, been able to help um, while you um, transitioned from one career to another. And, uh, yeah, here's to many more fun times to come. Um, and thank you also for a really generous super chat. That's really kind. Um, and Boren Mullen, I, have I fucked that up? I think that's how you say it, but it may be, it's possible I didn't. Uh, as I super chat saying, this is not the game for people with face blindness. It's me. I'm face blind. This channel got me through my degree and now my first TV job. So thank you. Congratulations. Um, I hope the TV job is bloody wonderful. And yeah, it's it's a difficult. Uh, it is a difficult game to play with um, face blindness. I think my my partner has face blindness, but has completed this. But yeah, woofed. Nice Rich said, so when Johnny's OBS dropped, I think they were saying they're gonna play Knack on Mondays. Yeah, that's it. Exactly. You're exactly right. Uh Knack Mondays, everyone. Knack Mondays. I haven't played it before, but I'm sure I'll get the hang of it. You're right, yes. Okie dokie, let's find out how this thing died. Doo -doo. Oh, fucking... Oh, uh, right. Well, we know how you bloody died. You got shot. By... This fellow. You were also there. You stripey, stripey man. And you were there. You hat-wearing fellow. And you were there. Man, I can't identify with certainty. Fucking hell. I mean, you died, but you really made it count, didn't you? Oh, and there's another corpse there. Are you are you dead dead? Oh, no, you're not dead dead. You're just helping. Cool. I mean, it's no... It's no exploding it in a fountain of, of viscera, but it's still pretty good. Okie dokie. Exotic Raven has done a super chat saying, I have a big thunderstorm going on outside. I guess Mother Nature thought I needed some atmosphere. Evidently. Right. Is that all? He says. Dying. Oops. No. No, no. Hit. 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 Yeah, there we go. Who is this? I'm not sure. How did they die? They were... They were sort of like... I guess they were spiked by a terrible beast. Who are you... Who are you? How did you first appear when a man was shot by Henry Brennan? It was this. Da -da -da -da. Now you're back here with the bosun. 
don't even know who this is yet. Oh, wait, back. no, and I don't know who this is with certainty. So many people to identify. Fucking hell. We still don't know who that guy is. Oh, this guy. What, what? Oh, no, there's the bosun. Okay. But wouldn't that make that the bosun's mate? Probably. If he's... If he's... I mean, he's wearing a similar hat. Ah, the hat meta beginneth. Oh, but look, your hat is similar to that hat. Fucking hell. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Right. Well, anyway, it's all quite horrible. You have died. Um, mm, 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 mm. Weekend Minis has done a super chat saying, in a previous stream, he said he didn't really get into or finish Breath of the Wild. But in two Ghosts of Tsushima videos, you mentioned you're playing Tears of the Kingdom a lot. I'm wondering why Tears of the Kingdom is doing it for you over Breath of the Wild. I did not like the Divine Beasts. And in fairness, I did put like 60 hours into Breath of the Wild. I just didn't finish it. Um, and at the minute I'm playing Tears of the Kingdom, I nearly gave up on it the other day, but then I sort of pushed on. I'm just bimbling around in it a lot, basically. Um, I probably won't finish this one either. So, um, I'm just playing it at the minute because it's a good fun game to play. I'm playing a lot of, um, oh, there's our Topman. Um, I'm playing a lot of Dead Cells at the minute, actually. <laughs> Orthogonalist says the term hat trick for scoring three goals actually comes from this game, where correctly identifying three people based on their hats will make the game lock them in. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Apparently the audio is cutting in and out a bit again for some people. Just refresh if you need to. Um, I'm getting no error messages or anything on my side, so I think it is YouTube side. No Switch says Tears of the Kingdom has a much more engaging story than Breath of the Wild, I think. Yes. Yes, I agree with that also. Um, Okie dokie. Gosh, I wish I was uh, identifying people more more often. But we'll see. Okay. Soldiers of the sea. Okay. Why is it done that for Soldiers of the Sea? This unknown soul was electrocuted. Nicholas Bosril was speared by a beast. This guy was spiked by a terrible beast. Location of the corpse. You are on the gun deck. By the thing. And you were speared. I want to have another look at that one. I want to have another look at that one. So I do. You were decapitated by a beast. You were speared by a beast. Why am I singing it at them? Hideous monster perish simultaneously with a brave but unfortunate soul. Poor unfortunate soul. Ah, also this one. I would leave my blood if my bloody Dane. Three others were present. That guy. That guy. And that guy. We know it's one of the... We know that this is one of the Peters brothers. Have we identified one of the Peters brothers? No, we haven't. So it could be Nathan Peters or Samuel Peters. And we just don't no, and it's annoying. Right. Now, uh, I want to... Right, we're going to the gun deck. Because I want to have another look at the guy who was speared to the wall. Bottom. What accent is that? I do not know. Right. Now, who is he? Who are you call him, boss? <laughs> hey, catch! He yells, dying. 
Somebody here is also French. And demon. I mean, they're likely not yelling to one another, are they? Who are you? Who are you? The steward's just this guy, but who is that guy? Bum, bum, ba -dum, bum, 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 ba bum, 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 bum. Blaze and Ace has done a super chat saying, Hey Johnny, is it true you used to work with the brilliant Jane Douglas at GameSpot? I still miss seeing you on Eurogamer and Dicebreaker. Much love. Yes. Um, I used to work with Jane from 2011 to when Jane left to found Outside Xbox. Um, so yeah, uh, we used to present videos together. Um, and it was just very good fun. Like Jane, Jane has always been a delight to work with, but also like was just really welcoming and um, yeah, great. Uh, Jane was doing. Well, Jane was a features editor at Gamesport UK, and I was a video producer. And Jane was also doing a lot of reviews, and the review process was obscene, like obscenely demoralising. It was awful. It was like all all reviews were peer reviewed, right? But none of the people peer reviewing the review had read the review so they were just nitpicking the language and being real dicks about it I used to read some of the feedback Jane would get and was just like how do you keep your chin up but um, yeah no yeah we used to work together there's probably still videos of us together at GameSpot UK um, but now we're older and wiser Jane's wiser certainly right okie dokie Okay, so you're an officer. Right, you are a fucking officer. One of the officers. And you could well be, on account of standing next to him, that officer's steward. Let's have a look at you, shall we? We're looking for a steward. Ship steward. You could be Zungi Sati. Well, you could be Davy James, the fourth mate steward, because ship steward is interesting. Because there's no, no, there's no officer called ship, <laughs> but a midshipman, possibly. But there's only one ship steward, so that wouldn't, in my opinion, there's an unknown midshipman. That's interesting. Who are you? Who are you? You're wearing a hat. The hat matter is alive. So, we know who the captain is. We've got the first mate down. We've definitely got the second mate down. What a POS. So we've got... Right. You could be the third mate or the fourth mate. But wait a minute. Wait a fucking minute. Martin, Martin is referred to by name by the captain's wife. She goes, Martin, we should be able to see him because he's yelling to her. Which means that we'd be ident able to identify, hopefully, the fourth mate. Interesting. Ethan Miguel Serki has done another super chat saying, just remembered I watched the Paxox Venture the other day. Sorry, the Botolf joke fell fell flat. I got it, but I was manning a booth and couldn't see it live. I don't remember that joke anymore. I mean, I, I never remember the live shows until I go back and watch them. Nice Switch says, can we hear how she yelled Martin again? Martin! That's how she did it. Right. We are... Sorry about it, speared to a wall. I was hoping to work out who you were. But I've got different fish to fry. And demon. Beat to course, there's enemy aboard. Out of the way, what's going on? Stay back, it's already done for Nick. Come on, boss. Who's boss? <laughs> Who's boss? All right, you know what? We'll be good. Well, we're going back to... Oh, I can't... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say Martin again. 
before you hear the audio. And you know what? If I cover my mouth, you'll, you won't be able to tell which one's which. I'm telling you now. Nice witch. Okie dokie. Oh, mmm, it is a spicy melange. Okie dokie. Hello there, Martin. Come on. Right. Martin. You brilliant son of a bitch. How have I not identified you before? You're Martin Pero, the third mate. Which means that this is, I think, the fourth mate, John Davies. Who was clubbed by? We're not sure. When did he die? Perished in the escape part five, which is on the gun deck by the stairs. That's right. Martin! James Gillette says, I thought you had ID'd, Martin. Me too, to be honest. But, there we go. Right, gun deck. Clump, 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 clump. Location of the corops. It's behind me. Here he is. Bottom. Okay. What's all this shit, Oh, fucking hell! Right. So we know that you're John Davies and you've been clubbed by... Henry Brennan! This is why it's good to go back. You were clubbed to death by Henry Brennan. <laughs> Starting to lose it a little bit. I shouldn't be so cheerful about all this death. And yet here we are. Yep. Come on. Gimme give gimme give gimme give forty seven. Gimme Pipeman. Mm, yes. Ha <sighs> bum bum. Bum bum. Bum bum. Bum bum. Tegan Evans says starting. Entirely fair. Um, ooh, PJ Buck has done a super chat saying, Hello Johnny and LSPs. I am VOD Squad again, but good news. Finally getting called in for the long-awaited job interview. BNB do crims with a black heart emoji, purple heart emoji, white heart emoji, and yellow heart emoji. Congratulations, PJ. That is great news. Absolutely phenomenal. Right. You, sir. H who are you? Right, so, one of these two has to be the bosun's mate. If you're not the bosun's mate, who would you be? The gunner? Christian Wolf? <gasps> Wait a minute. Wait a fucking minute. Yeah, no, let's have a look at this. Let's have a look at this one. Because we, were, we weren't sure whether this was the bosun, I think? Boing! Right. Enough, Captain cannot be trusted. Trade wretched fish and shells for gold. Her huh, who's there? Fresh bastard. Right, who's this? Do we know who this is yet? Ah, the fourth mate John Davies. Of course we do. Right. He could be the gunner's mate. I think that's more likely than him being Christian Wolf the gunner. I think this is Olus Vieta. And I'll tell you for why. Because of the 
accent with which he spoke, and we take ship and sail east is a grammatical idiosyncrasy that I think is more likely coming from an Eastern European person, such as a man from Poland, than an Austrian. That is what I think. Now, where's the bloody door? There we go. <laughs> nice which says, who wants to be in a post-punk band with me called Fresh Bastard? Uh, actually, yes, please. That sounds great. Let's have a look at this one. Da -dum. Can't remember this one. Put me down. Let's go. Come on. You're in a bad way. This is squid. Where is my Frenchman? The squid's gone. Your mate was torn apart. The damned. The beast is dead. How? How did you kill it? We didn't. It left with the storm. Oh, Clestial. Yeah, we know who that is. Damn. Gunner's mate. Gunner's, well, if that's the gunner, if that's the gunner's fucking mate, this is probably the gunner, right? Sure, why not? You nickels, you piece of shit. Who are you again? First mate, William Hosker. Hmm. Hmm. I think I'm I think I'm alright with with the I think I'm alright with with that summary. Christian Vol I just feel like right, he's the one literally giving the orders to fire. Perished in the Doom Part 4. Let's go have a look at when he died and where. Ah, yeah, that's right. He's the upside down man. <laughs> on the gun deck. Right, well, let's go see him. We're on the right deck after all. S stop being quite so cheerful, Johnny. It's just the process is satisfying, you know? Where's the owl? Where have you gone, you upside down fellow? I suppose your body wouldn't be upside down if it was upside down at the moment of your death. Ah, yes, that's right. You're over here in bits. Bottom. Now, 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 now. Right. Okay, you were you were blown apart. No pun intended. You were crushed by a terrible beast. And it looked like that. Somebody yelled the fuse with a French accent. Now we know for a fact from when this happens. We know for a fact when this happens that those people are on the other side of the door. Fucking hell. Now, in this guy's... Right, we know that's Christian Wolf. We're not sure who that is. This guy was crushed by a beast. He sat with Solomon Syed. Which could make him one of these three people. Charles Minor, the bosun's mate. This is an interesting one because when 
when um, the bosun, whose name escapes me now, which is annoying, um, when the bosun died, he said, where's my Frenchman? So the bosun's mate, we know is French, it says right there, and I swear, in this memory, we got a French accent at the start. But we know this to be Christian Wolf. This man is sat with Solomon Syed and he looks South Asian to me, which could make this guy the bosun's mate, but then he's dicing with some top men. But that's, you know, they're just, they're underway. Like, they're all, everyone's having a nice time. They're probably all mingling, right? I mean, that's an officer? Well, that's not an officer. Unknown. Unknown soul. I just suspect. Let's see the first memory he's in. Damn it! Of course it's this one. Bastard. It's always this one. Right, you are in nine memories. Perished in the doom. Show memories on deck. He's in unholy captives. That's not really going to give us much. Oh, the bosun's mate. That's his room, seemingly. I just reckon that might be the bosun's mate. That's my... It's my theory. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pencil him in. Ah, is it though? Fuck. Arrgh. Uh, there's still more to do on the cargo deck. Understood. I know, I know, I know. But I just want to know about this fucking guy. Nine memories. Perished in the Doom Part 4. Ah! Oh, never mind. No, wait. Uh, he was the one saying move by hands, wasn't he, in this one? Right, let's just leave this memory. I want to hear it again. This is the thing. No, wait. This is the wrong one to hear, isn't it? The fuse! Yeah, okay. So we know who you are now. That's Christian Wolf, the gunner. And then... Lord. That's Christian Wolf. Yep. No, there's no French accent in that at all. It's all just. It's all. That's all of it. Fucking. Um, Wolf. So I still know dick all about that guy. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. Let us get back to the cargo hold. We're going to go back to the cargo hold because there's more for us to find down there. But I'm going to physically take us to the cargo hold now. Um, cargo hold. This is the all up deck cargo hold. Ba, 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 ba. But we're going to take a short break um, momentarily. You're padlocked. Just going to let my pocket watch sniff something out here. We've done that one. Oh! What? What was... Hang on. So the pocket watch came out there. I swear it came out here as well. But that may just be... Um, God, I'm probably making some of you feel quite seasick just looking around as frantically as I am. Um, cargo hold. Cargo hold. Banana. Not in there. We know how you died, because you got 
all blowed up, right? Yeah. Soldiers of the Sea, part 8 of 8. Yes, fairly conclusively, that's how you died. Bang! Nice Switch says, I'm pretty sure I mentioned this uh, last week, but for anyone who's a fan of this game, The Curse of the Golden Idol has similar mystery solving and it's absolutely brilliant. I cannot wait to play that one. I'm very excited. Oh! Oh ho ho! Seems like we've found some flies. Uh, is someone dead in a barrel? Uh, we'll find out after a five minute break. Because uh, I need to pee and get some water. How about you? Um, have you? When was the last time you got up and had a nice little stretch? Are you too warm? Are you too cold? Are you? Do you need a snack? Do you need some water? Do you need something else to drink? Just basically look after yourself for five minutes and then we'll come back and we'll play more of Return of the Obra Dinn. Um, if you're never going to... If you're never going to... What the fuck? If you're not going anywhere for the next five minutes, don't worry, there's some smooth jazz and a picture of my dog, but I will be back.
Ahoy, everybody. Welcome back to this stream on youtube.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. That is me. I am Johnny Chiodini. And we are playing Return of the Obra Dinn, which is this. And we are in the cargo hold. And we have found some telltale flies that tell us it's time for a memory. Somebody was stowing away, somebody died. Oh no, wait. Okay, unknown. Hello, you, who we have identified, Alexei Toporov. You there? Oh, look who's showing off over here. I'm so big and strong and dead. <laughs> I died of an illness. Ah, Solomon. You died of illness. One of the cooler, cool, cooler, cool, cool, uh, kinder, kinder ways to go. That's the word I was looking for. Okay. Haiku Roy says, Toporov is a great name for a bartender. There's a... It's weird. There's a a man in the, the beer shop that's not too far from from me. And they have like a loyalty scheme and you give them your name and they're like, alright, let's put your points on there. And my partner bought some beer from there but didn't have the... Uh, it was a stowaway. Well, well, well. You were crushed inside a falling barrel. Um, my partner went in, bought some beers and just gave my name to put the, the loyalty on there. And the guy was like, damn, that's a cool name. Damn. I'm going to steal that name. And my partner was like, uh, what? And he was like, yeah, like if I, you know, like I ever write like a movie script or something, like, ah, oh, I'm just going to, going to like submit like, under the name, like Johnny Chiodini. Like, that's such a cool name. And I'll, I'll, just, I'll use it. I'll be my, my professional name. And they were like, okay. And just left. It didn't say anything. But I've been in a couple of times since. Every time I give my name. He's like, oh man, yeah, such a cool name. And he hasn't said anything to me about like, I'm going to steal that name. And obviously I don't want to be that person. I don't want to lean across the counter and be like, listen, buddy, if you Google me, I'll come up as a result. But it's like, am I, is he trying to steal my, my identity or is he trying to supplement my own career? I don't really get it. Jukebox345 says they took your Instagram profile. Holy shit. Oh my God. God damn it. Hoist away, lower away. Yeah, you were a, um... Will says, Johnny, is this you covering for a script you're trying to sell? No. No. Nuh-uh. Okay, so. Sto stowaway died, but so did this guy. Poor dead stowaway in a barrel. Right. Emotional support Viking says, but who did you steal the name from, Johnny? Well, there was a there was a famous guitarist called John Chiavini, who I think's retired. So I guess him. But my SEO game is stronger than his, so. I'm not trying to sell a script, everybody. I promise. Would I write a semi-autobiographical Predator movie that, like puts me against the monster? No! Don't be silly. Fucking hell! Right. I heard it. One of you's French. Oh, what a way to go. Tell me who you are! Right, who'd this? Okay. Well, yeah, you got crushed by falling cargo. Why 
Why does taking s snails on a French ship make it quicker to load so that you can set sail sooner? Let's go! Oh dear. Oh no. Good luck or a quick death has done a super chat, but there's no message attached because good luck or a quick death doesn't say awful things like me. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> okay. Uh, yes, you got crushed by falling cargo. You're still there. Okay. Oof dear, oof dear business. Sarah Wilkins says, be honest, Johnny, you don't regret that one bit. I don't really know. Okay. You. Right. Damn it. The deceased did not speak at any point. You were crushed by falling cargo. Okay, now what I would really dearly like is to be able to go. I like. No, it's not going to help. One of you sounded French, though. Show yourselves. There's no way up. There's no way up. Oh wait, there is. But no, 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 no. <sighs> Damn it. Hmm. Ah, ah, excuse me, sir. No, we know who you are. You're dead to me. Quite literally, because you died. Oh, I'll get you. I'll find out your identities one of these days. Hmm. Okie dokie. Loose cargo. All right. So I've been warned about this. Uh, if I get in that boat, it'll end the game, but I don't have to, at any point, I don't have to go down there until I'm good and ready. So that's fine. Because I fucking won't. Because I want to find out what happened to all of these people. We know what happened to you. And to you. Are there any more down here? There must be more. We've kind of already been in here because we did the stowaway. Poor stowaway. The stowaway got stowed away, look. And that's where we keep... Yep, that's where we keep that. Okay. All right. Does that mean I've now seen everything, I wonder? Let's see. Loose cargo. Oh no, it's the bit I've dread dreaded this whole time. I've seen everything, haven't I? Now it's just time for me to... work everything out. Oh! 
Okay. Disappeared in the doom on page... Yeah, well, we know he disappeared in the doom. Okay. You, you fucking bastard. You've been, you are all over this bloody ship. I swear, I swear, if he turns out to be the bosun's mate solely because he's wearing a stripy top, I'll be livid. <laughs> The purser, the carpenter, the carpenter's mate, the passengers, there's so much. Fuck. Oh, God. Oh, wow. The enormity of this, the enormity of this has really just come home to me. We don't even know how that guy died because he disappeared. Okay. Alrighty. Okie dokie. Mart Martin! We don't know how Martin died. That's weird. Martin. Nine memories. First memory. Where did you die, though? Um, Rogue Monitor has done a super chat saying, I tried to oven some frozen chips shop chips. Oh my god, I can't believe how many chips I've been missing. Yeah, right? Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Uh, um, oh god, words are hard. Um, yeah, it's great. If you've got leftover chips from like a proper chippy, bang them in the freezer and then treat them like oven chips and they go delicious all over again. I feel like, I genuinely feel like I changed lives last time. Right. Nine memories. First memory. Show memories on dick. Unholy Captives part four. A Bitter Cold part two. The Doom part five. The Doom part two. Unholy Captives. The Doom part seven. And then the Doom part eight. Martin! The Doom Part 8, is that really the last? But we know... Mm, okay, well, I'll go have a look at it. I'm just curious. I just want, like... We don't see how Martin dies, right? But... I don't see Martin as one of the people who disappeared in the Doom. Which makes me wonder. Did he survive? Oh, it's, it is, sure enough, stormy. Um, <clears throat> Shaws the Great and Powerful, a.k.a. P. Noctum, has done a super chat saying, regarding your find pig posts on Twitter, do we need to crowdfund, crowdfund a lowjack for Watson so you don't keep on losing her? I'm kind of getting worried. I, she has a tracker. She's just very good at hiding. Um, she is currently in the bedroom on the bed. Martin! Martin, tell me your secrets. Did you fall on your sword, Martin? This is the last anyone saw of you, Martin. But how can it be? Because you're back on the ship. The Doom? Yeah. You're back on the ship, though, and you were leaving before. Anonymous says, there's one very general tip regarding fates I could give, but I don't want to do any unsolicited backseating. Give me the tip, Anonymous. I'm giving you permission. Um, 
please let me know. Um, mm -mm -mm. Uh, Nido King 042 has sent a super chat saying, mostly keeping quiet because I know the game inside and out, but I wanted to let you know I'm enjoying the stream and not particularly shouting anything while watching. <laughs> Good, I'm glad. I hope it's not stressful for you. Okay. There's just a lot, isn't there? Torn apart by beast. <gasps> Wait a fucking minute. Clestial. That's... Oh, if that's the bosun's mate, I'm going to be... <gasps> it fucking is, isn't it? He had his arm torn off. He had his arm torn off. Not all fates are pointed out by the watch. Some are just seen in a scene where someone else eats it. Right, yeah. He had his arm torn off. And then he was like, where's my Frenchman? And it, they said... Squid's... The squid's gone. Your mate was torn apart. <laughs> <laughs> You're the bussin's mate, and you were torn apart by a beast. Please. Oh, I was really hoping it was going to go boom, Tim. Okay, but we know that, right, you were torn apart by a beast. Oh, it's such a good game. Come on. Okay, we know you were shot. Um... Will says, hey Johnny, what's that type of shirt called? Frenchman shirt? Why the shirt though? Because it's stripey! Stripey shirt. I don't know. Um, Web Giant is on a super chat saying, this has me thinking of the sea shanty. Mental health is less grim if you pretend it's old boats featuring Johnny Chiodini with Luke Westaway. That was a good fun recording time. Right, we know you're Paul Moss and you got killed with a sword. Breton. Oh, it's a Breton shirt. Right. Okay, you are two ladies. <laughs> two ladies, eh? Right, there's Emily Jackson and Miss Jane Bird. But I think there's another name, isn't there, somewhere? It was worn by the French Navy. Well, look at me not knowing that. Emily Jackson and Miss Jane Bird. They're both passengers. Miss Jane Bird is presumably the younger of the two. So I'm going to just... I'm going to say, you are... This feels weird, though, because it's a three-chuck gas. Haiku Rise down a super chat saying, I don't know the solutions, but this is riveting and I believe in you. Thank you very much. Okay. Emily Jackson and Miss Jane Bird. Passengers. I mean. But they're three star guesses. Does that just mean that it's not pointed out to me? I'm going to declare you Miss Jane Bird. Why not? No. No, I'm going to declare you Miss Jane Bird. And you can be... Emily Jackson. And I'm just... Mm. Ah, Finley! Finley, old pal! Oh, look at you! You are being torn apart by a beast. Torn apart by a beast. Hmm. It's not rewarding me. Not rewarding me with delicious noises. Hello! And you are... dead. 
I'm going to say you're getting crushed by beast. And you are one of the fellas. <sighs> Arguing Ryan says, I think the stars are based on the certainty on the basis of the information available. Okay, right. Boren Mullen says, I have to say I went into this game completely... This is a super chat, by the way. I have to say I went into this game completely blind, so the Kraken attack scene was genuinely... Oh, she was hit by a mast. What broke the... What the... <laughs> Which I think is great. Okay. Now then. You, sir, are clubbed by our Witteral. And that's Mabba. You there. 14 memories. 14 of them. Okay, he was there. You met your end. Right at the end. You were there to the last. Oh, you're the fellow who went over the back. Who the fuck are you, though? Fourteen bloody memories. Show me those memories. Where are we? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. That's where you died. Fourteen memories. Show them on the deck map. Martin! I want my husband! Smash! I'm gonna find out who you are. I'm gonna find out who you all are, and you're gonna be in a lot of trouble when I do. Any. Alright, is there any more. Anyone else here secretly, secretly meeting their end? I'm not seeing it, so let's move on. A couple of buckets back there, though. Oi, 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 oi. Pandalf Darwin says, hi, Johnny. Hi, Pandalf Darwin. We know how you died. Emma Benton says, I mean, they're dead, Johnny. How much more trouble can they be in? Do you want to find out, Emma? Because I'll show you. But, um... We still don't know who you are. That's Paul Moss. Ah, well, well now. That's a surgeon. That's Miss Jane Bird, I reckon. I reckon this is... Zungi. How can we see what's here? Okay. That's Paul Moss. You're not taking the last boat. Blah, blah, blah. William Hoskett. Henry Brennan. John Davies, Walter, that's where he went. Oh. There's so much going on. 
What's throwing me is I don't have a methodology now for going through and trying to piece together all the bits. I feel like every piece of information I've put in since we reached the end of all of the memories has been kind of just sheer luck. Maybe I should just start going through all of them. Because I was... I could get another one through here, couldn't I? I know, we're really getting into the into it here, everyone. I just remind you, please resist the temptation to backseat. Or to offer me unsolicited clues. Put me down. Let go. Easy now. Will says, would you like a tip about the best way to approach this? Not a spoiler, but a direction. Go on then. Yes, please, Will. Your mate was torn apart. Left with the store. Captain came up from the hold. Said he chased it off. Peter Bateman. Also, you can go for it. If you're offering me a tip with one of the mechanics that will help with deductions, that'd be nice. Don't follow people, follow the story and check each memory in order. Yeah. That felt about right. Okay, follow the story, check each memory in order. Let's do it. Yeah, of course, chronological. That makes a lot of sense. Okie dokie. Right. Is everything you have in your possession? Okay. Orthogonalist has done a super chat. Oh, Braiku Din. I want my husband. Her final words are good, but not as good as damn. <laughs> Very good, I like it. Okay. Uh, Sarah Waller has done a super chat saying, Just got here, so I need to go to the start. It's my papa's second birthday on Sunday, so take my money to celebrate the best friend I could ever ask for. That's wonderful. That's really lovely stuff. Um, congratulations on uh, the second birthday. Happy birthday to your pup pup for Sunday. Ah, Peter Bateman says, You are able to assign people from unknown person to unknown rank. Help me with the Seaman versus Topman, for example. That is a very good point. Right, we're going to apply that while also going through the story in chronological order, starting with Loose Cargo. EJ has done a super chat. The super chat has no message attached. Was this deliberate? If it wasn't, just type as per normal in chat and I will um, read it out with all of the necessary fanfare. So, gun deck. Let me through. All up deck. Cargo hold. EJ says, I'm on VOD squad, but popping over here to point out you're an absolute treasure, Johnny. Thank you, that is very kind. All right. Here we go. Loose cargo. Okie dokie. Right. We don't know who this is. Yet. I thought I'd identified this guy. I really thought I'd identified this guy. What? Did I not? Which one of you's 47? Hold the fucking... F hold the fucking phone. The crew? No... Ah! The UI. 47. Yeah, it's in there. That's ticked off. Oh, Lars Linder being clubbed by unknown. Do we remember him? The Doom Part One. I know I'm going through this in 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 chronological order, but oh, it's really annoying me. 
Oh no, it's one of the fucking brothers. Okay, never mind. This unknown. Oh, that's what these unknowns are. Unknown Topman. Okay. No, not that one. Right, the dead did not speak in this one. And we know who you are and how you died. You died due to illness. And I have reason to believe that you are a seaman rather than a topman. That's Solomon Syed. That's Alexei Toporov. I just don't know who you are. <laughs> but it's... If they're stowing stuff... It feels like they are also seamen, right? Seamen and then seamen, I'm going to say... James Giet says, I also might have a kick yourself thing that I noticed, but don't want to spoil it. Go on. You can ha you, you. I'm going to let you say it. Please say it. You're all being very good while I just sort of clip clop around here being confused. I appreciate it. Lars Linda, killed by one of the Peters brothers. You never put in who shot the hat guy in the mutiny when we had the name. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mutiny, mutiny. Um... Ah, uh, fuck. Which one was it? Who was it? Who was it? Who was it? It was... Was it Davies? It was one of the mates. It wasn't Hosker. And it fucking definitely wasn't Nichols. I think it might have been John Davies, you know? That's a good point. So, Hatfellow was shot by Davies, I'm pretty sure. Yes! Ah! Oh, fucking hell. Thanks, James. Yes! Bum bum. Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. Bum bum. Not even halfway. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> Sorry, I scared the shit out of you, nice witch. I was just very excited. Okay. Oh, that felt nice. Okie dokie. Now, 
loose cargo. Number two is the stowaway in the barrel. Oh. Oh. Barrels. Where have you gone, stowed away, stowaway? Yeah, it is that one, isn't it? Oh, but you're in the cargo hold at the front. The bow, I should say. Which is this way? Avidosian Chulak 2 says, the best part is you do all this work and there's no way in hell the folks at the insurance office are believing all of this. <laughs> um, where are the fucking barrels? Oh, good, a headache. A headache, that's what I need. Okay, Nidder King, go for it. If there's a feature I'm overlooking, tell me about it. Why not? If it's bookmarks, then I sort of know about those. Linda again. The lower right of each page will tell you all of the living people who are in a scene anywhere. Huh? Oh, you mean this? How many others were present? Yeah. Yeah, I knew, I knew that. Um, I have used it in the past. Twelve others were present. The spiked man, the surprised guy. If you click it, you can see which people they are. I know. Don't worry. Dum, 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 dum. Who the fuck are you? Oh. Ah, oh, Giancarlo Di Mario says, Hi Johnny, a real throwback, but thanks for your video on the stuffed vine leaves from Chiodini's Kitchen. It's become a massive crowd-pleasing starter when I cook for people. You're very welcome. Um, oh, I found some vine leaves in Brian the other day and I bought them. I forgot about that. I should make vine leaves soon. They are delicious. Ah... Uh... I'm starting to feel very not clever. This one is a real bastard. There were 22 people. And I feel like this this one is just so important to the narrative. Let's go see Solomon again. Ufta. Okay. So, we know that uh, basically there was a mishap with some cargo setting off. And then an illness came aboard. Oleander Moya says, oh, this is Oleander's first ever super chat. Thank you. 
saying, Hi Johnny, first super chat, just want to say love the stream and that you were the reason I realised and came out as Envy, thank you. Oh, you're, you're very, very welcome, Oleander, and congratulations on um, coming out as Envy yourself. Like, that is absolutely fantastic. Okay, so that's Solomon Syed. We're not sure who you are, but we know you're crushed by falling cargo. So you could be William Wasim, Abraham Akbar, or Renfred Rajub. You similarly. Ah ah ha 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 ha! What a minute! You're in your fucking bunks! You're in your bunks! You're in your bunks. Why does that one just say X? <laughs> Why is that not a number? Because X is 10 and... Are oh, you Winston Smith the carpenter? We did hear an American accent. At one point I was like, that is a bad American accent. But... Right, bunks. Here we fucking go. Number 51. That's Renfred. Renfred? This is 53. Oh, but what if no one's in his bunk? That would make you, sir, out of your bunk. Number 53. <laughs> Which would mean that you, being the by process of elimination, and racial profiling, with evidence, I would think that you are Abraham Akbar. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, that felt fucking great. Who else is in their bunk? Let me see you. 58. Let me see your face. Oh, you're being coy now. 56. You're being coy now. 56. I, I'm gonna find a 56. Come here, 56. <laughs> 56. Ah, Henry Brennan. Well, we we've no we know oh I know all about you, Henry Brennan. Oh What else have we got here? Oh, we can sort of see in. You're wearing a shoe. Fifty seven there. Eh? Me Thrill has done a super chat saying, We're ha whoa, we're halfway there. Whoa, leave it on a brew. Right. This foot. Have I seen this foot anywhere else? <laughs> oh no. Oh no, I feel like I'm on a very specific wiki. Okay. Okay. More feet. Jukebox345 says, it's Johnny, it's rude to upskirt people as they sleep. I'm going to do you one better, Jukebox. I'm going to say it's rude to do it at all. <laughs> right, number 40. Tell me about yourself, number 40. Oh, God, that felt so fucking good. Lee Hong, one of the top men. Okay. All right. 38. Now, 
these lads playing cards. We don't know who you are. We know who you are. We don't know who you are. That is... <gasps> Three empty bunks! Ha ha ha! 47. Let me see the numbers. Let me see them! Why can I know? Aha! 45 and 46. Right. So, you are either Leonol, Leonid, or Alarcus. And one of you is a topman and one of you is a seaman. Right. Who was electrocuted? One of the topmen was electrocuted. I appear to have got John Naples wrong. But that's okay. We'll get there. Burned. Crushed. Yada, yada, yada. Burned. Clawed. Yada, yada, yada. Clubbed. Decapitated. Where have you gone, electrocuted Topman? That's weird. I'll be back this particular clue. Because it's either... Right, we've, we've got 45 and 46 in here. Captain Shiny has summoned the Blood Pair. I'm not sure whether to cheer me on or... Try and scare me off. Right. I'll not take murder. I'm gonna fucking get ya. I'm gonna fucking get the lot of ya. Ah. That's interesting. Apparently, John Naples was not torn apart by a terrible beast. But this is the one I wanted. This is the one I wanted. Um, ah! Location of the corpse. Main deck. Over there. Right. I know we're meant to be going... Oh, I know that it's helpful to go uh, in chronological order. But I need to... I just need to satisfy my curiosity... Ah, oh, there you are. Da -dum. Soldiers of the Sea, part one of eight. Okay. Now I am hoping... Okay, no. 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 <laughs> My little topman, you Leonid, Leonid Volkov, there you are. You're a topman. And that makes you, by process of elimination, Alarcus. Please? Fuck. Am I wrong? It didn't go bump dip. Didn't go bump dip at all. I was so convinced. I just want one little bump dip. Oh, okay. Right, let's have a look. This unknown soul was electrocuted. Yes. Okay. Okay. The crew. No, the crew. Shot cannon, Christian Wolf, shot cannon unknown. I'm still not ready to write that one in. 
Killed sword unknown. That's fine. That wouldn't give us anything. Drowned beast. Alarcus did not drown with our beast, we may assume. Naples was not torn apart by a beast. Peter Bateman says you didn't have a murderer to get a bum dip. Oh, do you want to get a bump dip as... I know it's sets of three, but we've got multiple things that should be fine. Should be written in, right? Does it have to... Does there have to be a buy somebody to give you the bump dip? Wait a fucking minute. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, who killed you now? I fucking know who killed you now. Let's go have a look. Hello, Paul. Last one. Move quick, 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 quick. Well, if they doesn't, Leonid, I think. This is going to be a pain to undo if I'm wrong. Uh, Leonid. Brandon Hart has done a super chat saying, I'm sorry about all of the blood pairs, Johnny. Here is another attempt at appeasement of the blood pair. And remember, when you feel like you don't know, just redact it. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> what if I'm wrong about Vol Vol Volkov? You're a topman! Look at you. Right. Look at you. How many other fucking Russian topmans are there? None! I've got you, Leonid. I know who you are. Right. Oh, yeah. How did you... Who killed you? Perished in the escape part three. Oh, yeah. You were shot by an unknown at attacker. So, in fact... May I suggest chronology? Yes, Argya. But once I've done this, this last look, I want to just have a deeks at this. Just to make sure I've not missed anything. Or rather... Now I think that's Emma I think that's Emily Jackson, but I don't know. But I'm gonna put it in. Oh, but Nunt <laughs> Fucking yes! You were drowned by a terrible beast, I knew it! Bada dum. Fucking yes! Pom pom, tim pom pom, tim pom pom, pom pom. Oh god. Are we gonna have to. We're gonna have to fucking kill a frequency, this, aren't we? Mithril says, did Johnny just dab? Yes, Johnny did just dab. <clears throat> Chris Bowen says, okay, point of clarification on fates, Johnny. Yes, please. I mean, it sounds like I need three X was killed by X in order to get the bump bump, bump dips, right? Abadosi and Chulak 2 says, that means you made a freaking Hail Mary play on who those two women were. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Okie fucking dokie. Oh, I'm going to find out. Anybody you have penciled in right now is incorrect. Right, okay. Yeah, let's investigate things. Martin! We don't know how Martin died. We don't know how you died. Right. Christian Volf shot cannon. Oh! Meh. No, but that is, that's got to be Christian Volf. Okay, Naples was not torn apart by a beast. Naples met an unknown fate. But I want to investigate it. Oh, 
Oh, shit. Of course, he wasn't torn apart by a beat. He was knifed by... Thingy. Naples was knifed... By... Philip. That's what I reckon. Now. Christian Wolf, shot, cannon, unknown. <clears throat> oh, I just don't know who you are and how you died. <laughs> oh, but I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Whoever you are. Right, Christian Wolf, six memories, perished in the doom. I'm gonna have a look at it again. This is another one that's really causing me problems. Ba dum All right. Wait a minute. Wait a fucking minute. Okay. I'm going to say that he was shot by Akbar, but I've just realized something. Um Okay, comments like you're overthinking it lol looks pretty obvious to me. Not helpful. <laughs> Not helpful. Um, we'll see about that one. We'll see. But that one's been causing me trouble for ages. But I just remembered the fucking... Garena Rain has done a super chat saying that I'm VOD squad this week so you are spared one blood pair from me. Happy spooky puzzling. Thank you very much, Garena. And I'll see you in VOD Squad. Um, he wasn't. He wasn't killed. Cause look, uh, not this one. The the guy I just said was knifed. Um, he he lived. He lived. Of course he lived. Cause didn't he lose his leg? Naples. Naples was the one. I'm pretty sure Naples was the man with the fucking peg leg. But wait, hang on a minute. Five memories. Perished in Unholy Captives Part 4. No, that is when he died. Oh. All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. But he died. So he did die. Which would suggest that he was knifed. So he did die. Knifed. By. The Swedish guy. What if it was a sword, though? Was it a knife? Was he shot? I need to go have a look. I need to go have another look. I'm going to have another look. I'm going to have another look. Oh, okay. yeah. You're, you're towing the line pretty close, mate. To, to, I, would, I would say you're, you're backseating me a little bit, buddy.
cargo hold up the front. No, wrong end of the ship, Johnny. Oh yeah, we had his leg. Okay. But um Keep pressure here. A sword. It was in fact a sword. Uh which makes sense because his legs off. Killed with a sword. The Captain Steward, Philip Dahl. Well, well, well. And we don't know how he died. Okay. Gillenborum says, well, that's that's been sorted. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Now then. Let's get back to the chronology. So, we got to a bitter cold. 22 others were present. We've got these guys down, and this lot, and Botterill, Mabba. How many have we got in here that aren't known? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That is rather too many, I fear. Who are you? Wait, is there one Russian passenger left? A Russian person left. No. Okay. So you just like hanging out with them, eh? But what if you're Polish? Basically, in this one, there's a, there's 22 people in this memory. Quite a few of them are... Basically, more of them that... More of them... There are loads of them are unknown, so I can't just match up the bunk numbers. Uh, I'm going to go back to that memory, though. Hello, you. Don't worry, I'll get this all squared away eventually. da -dum. <laughs> Okay, right. We know who all of these lads are. We know that's Syed. We know that's Mr. Wasim. We know that's Renfred. We've since identified Leonid, Alarcus, and Alexei. Dum 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 dum. There are so many people in this memory, but it's not an across two decks thing, so it is solely based on the numbers, 57 and 58. Oh, 
Alexander Booth is in this. So, for ex allegedly, Alexander Booth is in here. <laughs> now, oh, no, no, that's interesting. Okay, so that's Alexander Booth. 56, 55, 57, 58. Uh... Fifty-five, six, seven, and eight. Fifty-five, six, seven, and eight. These are all seamen. I mean, imagine what a gift that would be if these were the four who were sat together in the picture. No. <laughs> oh. Oh what? Have we even oh, no we have identified you. Right, yeah, we all we did all of these ones. <sighs> Are we back to looking at legs? Are we really doing this? Silver Comet says, Johnny, do you mind if I make a suggestion or tip? Go for it. Why not? I could probably use it at this point. All right, so that's O'Hagan's. We know that we know... That's O'Hagan. We know how you die. Alexander Booth. Fifty five, fifty six. Ah, now, fifty five is our man from Sierra Leone. Ah. Reese says, are there rules for what suggestions or tips we can give if we ask really nicely? I mean, yeah, just don't spoil things for me. Don't be like, look at this, or like, it's this guy. You know, I've had some useful tips that are like, go in chronological order, or... Yada yada yada. Um, oh, Silver Comets. Okay, Silver Comet says if you're going to keep playing for a while, I think a squeezy wee to give your mind a break might really help. Yeah, I think I probably will go for a wee. I'm going to go for a wee. I'll be back in like a minute or two.
Wait a minute. Wait a bloody minute. Okay. All right, hang on. Twenty two others were present. Damn it. No, I thought I was being clever. Twenty two others were present. This guy and this guy. I've th I thought I narrowed it down to the guy from Sierra Leone. Fuck. Mm. Wandering Weird is on a super chat saying, Johnny, just wanted to say thank you for being such a lovely person and creating this community, which is a haven I look forward to daily. Much love. Thank you very much. Um, that is very, very kind of you. Um, uh, I kind of, when I started doing this, I wanted to make a nice community, but I'd never sort of imagined that people would say words like haven and things like that, which is very, very lovely. Okay, so basically, my thought there was, right... We got 56, 57, 58, and... 56, 57, 58, and... Oh, 55. And I know that... Matt K. Fryguys is on a super chat saying, here's a squeezy wee tip. Wee. <laughs> Thank you. Right, so we know in these bunks we've got Henry Brennan, Alexander Booth, Patrick O'Hagan, and George Shirley. Oh, no, 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 sorry. It's 55. So we've got Hamadou Dion in these bunk, this bunk. And my hope was that the other fellow with dark skin wasn't in wasn't in the memory so we could just process of elimination it but now I'm curious about these are all topsmen are you Omid Gull? I think you might be. You disappeared in the doom. Which is irritating. Ethan says, I would love to give a tip to sort of look at this, but only because you've skipped right past the thing several times today and it's kind of meta. I only caught it on my third watch this week. No, thank you. No, thank you. Let me work in this. Let me work away. There is a temptation to try and brute force bits of it, which is very annoying. Like this guy. Like this guy. This guy's just hanging out. He's just hanging out with some Russian-speaking fellas. But they're probably bilingual. Let's revert to I will ask I will ask you when um when I need when I need help, please. Thank you very much. This guy is fucking Who are you? I'm no longer feeling great about that previous guess. I was getting myself in a tiny bit of a tizzy. Uh, oh, but that's not a bad guess. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I was getting myself in a bit of a tizzy because I was like, oh, I want to finish this by 8pm. I'm not going to finish this by 8pm. Um, and I think if I try and just keep streaming until I do it 
I'm, it's going to be really unsatisfying because I'm I'm just going to end up taking more and more clues and basically I'm going to have my hand held for this whole thing. So I might go to a third stream. We'll we'll see basically. Um, right, let's have a little reset. Let's just Michelle uh, Kedor. Chedor? I'm so sorry, Michelle. I've definitely said your name wrong at least once now. Uh, has done a super chat saying, So much fun watching how someone else's mind works while working through the awesome puzzle game. Thanks, Johnny. You are very welcome. I love this game, even if I... It's it's genuinely quite nerve-wracking streaming puzzle games. Because I'm always there being like, well, Do people think I'm just silly or slow? Or just let me see your faces. It'd be so much easier. And I'm just having to think a lot of this through. Like, hello, who are all you? Did we? Did I already say hi to you, lot? Did we already have a look at you? Who's number thirty-nine? Oh, it's all of the top man. Who's thirty-six? Thirty-six. Thirty-six. I just love some more clues, sort of around, like when there was a pipe. I haven't got a, like a birthday card or a, an arm, an arm with a tattoo. We like to see it. 37. We love to see it, in fact. Right. The lady arm tattoo is on Timothy Buttment. <laughs> Butement? Timothy. All right. Let's see if we get lucky and it, we can just see the tattoo around uh are you no all right well i tell you what we'll do so we'll go timothy no wait we can't do it that way can we okay we're going back to oh you little tattooed man uh 37 anything else anything else here Ugh. I can't even see your numbers. What's your number then? 36. All by your lonesome. Okay. Timothy Buttman. Okay. Timothy Buttman. Let's go back on the top deck. Booty biddy biddy. Web Giant said, did they just say tattooed man in a French accent? Yes I did, but that was more for emphasis. Bottom. Okay. Okay. Show me all of your tattoos. Let me see your arm. Oh, you cheeky sod. Oh, we know who you are. <laughs> and you are... No! It was definitely a right arm, wasn't it? Oh, I was so hopeful he'd be here. Doom, 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 doom. I mean, there's one person we haven't checked. Yes, I didn't think it was going to be you. Doom, 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 doom. Wait a fucking minute, who are you? Oh, oh, hello. Is that really clubbed by R. Witteral? No, because you got clubbed. I didn't even see all of this lot. Fuck, there's so many people in here. Can I get down? I can't get down from the lines. This game is so good. It's so good. Okay. That is... Stop showing me it's it's clubbed by our Witrel. Why is everyone supposed to be clubbed by our Witrel? <laughs> okay, right. Electrocuted. Yes, we know. No. <sighs> Sorry, what I wanted was 
Persian soldier of the sea, yes. Fourteen others were present. Show me your fucking arms. I'm desperately trying to work out who the person going down the thing in order to be eaten by a thing is. <laughs> I can't get a good look at them. <sighs> this game is so good. All right, let's keep looking. More beasties. Bam, bam, ba dum, dum. Can't zoom in on any of them, so it doesn't really matter. We know who you are. I mean, you don't have a tattoo. And it was on your right arm. On his right arm. Is there any height? There's no higher we can get. This one is tantalizing. And I just didn't realize before just how many people you can see in this memory. And it's... Oh. Okay. Now, the electrocution was at the st start of Soldiers of the Sea. Oh, that's Botterill. Okay, that's fine. That's Botterill. Which means that seven more were present. So we can get a look at everyone down there. If we just go to the next one. Okay. All right. Oh, it's much more relaxing now I've decided not to try and do absolutely everything. In one fell swoop. Ah, Bottrell. Bottrell, my boy! Okay. Nice Witch asked an important question. Would you rather die to a Kraken cuddle or a many boobid mermaid? I'm not sure. Okay. We know that that's Bottrell. Right. Show me your arms, gentlemen. Oh, your arm is in shadow. Your arm does not. Well, we know who you are. Dum de dum dum. There he is, the bosun's mate, Charles. There you are, sir. Coming down. Oh. Oh, yeah, we know about that one. This guy's really annoying me. <laughs> we know who you are. We don't know who you are, and that is. It peeves me. I don't know who you are, and that peeves me. I know who you are. Sod off. This is a goat. Okay, alright. Let's see. I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to go right back to... Um, uh, is Ilman. Uh, Syed. I'm going to go straight back there. I'm going to have another look at that tattoo. I'm going to have another think about what's going on. I am on the wrong deck. Because of course I am. But he's just down here. Da -dum. Okay. <laughs> Poor Sayed. Yeah, it's the right arm. Mary Poppins, just there. He's having a snore. And that's Crewman 37. 
Right, so we know he's alive. You know what? Let's continue to to carry on. Let's crack in, crack up, crack on until we see that tattoo. Let's do it. It's got to show up. It's got to be here somewhere. Uh, and then this one. Oh, it's the fellow being brought down. There we go. Da da. <laughs> Gillen Borum says he was killed by a supercalifragilistic expiali blowfish. Same as the other fellow. Some lung disease. Not a consumption. Okay. Made worse by the cold. Will it spread? If so, we'd all have it. They must have picked it up the last Okay. Ah, so loud. Um. Peter Bateman says, did we say we were finishing at 8 p.m.? I'm on the Sea of Thieves with the crew tonight. Yes, I'm going to finish at 8 p.m. We know who you are. You're the surgeon's mate. You're the Formosan people. I just want to look at some people's arms. Is that so much to ask? Apparently. Okay. Uh, next, on the all up deck. We are currently on. Well, we're on the right deck. Okay, so we're going this away. Oh, yeah, so the, where the, uh, the moo cow was killed. But, um. This feels like a very slim lead to be following quite so hard. And yet. Uh, I'm going to carry on. You're a midshipman. How many more midshipmans do we have? You're either Peter or Thomas. You're an exploded midshipman. <laughs> you. You. I've got a feeling about you, you little bastard. Ten memories. Show them on deck. Oh, God. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Uh, show me your memories on deck. Show memories on deck. Three. Just trying to think of times when names would have been used, but God, you were busy on the uh, on the all up, weren't you? The Doom Part Five. Ha. Huh. Okay. You know what? We're just gonna we are gonna keep chasing down this tattoo, because I just think it's worth doing. Well it's not Nuno Pasqua, and we know for a fact that there are only three people present, all of whom have been accounted for. So that is not the memory we need. Now this one is probably going to be useful. Nice rich. <laughs> Says, busy on the all up is what I call it when I do a rude thing that I am redacting. <laughs> perfect. Absolutely perfect. Right.
Dudum. Okay. Arms out, everybody. Let's see them. Want to use a Butman, and I know it. Where are you, Butman? Curse these long sleeved uniforms. Did the chicken do it? Mr. Wolf, when you are ready. Right, sir. Ready, men. Show me your goddamn forearms! Fuck's sake. It, uh, uh. Oh, no, we know who you are. You are French. Fuck. Uh, Bob Fry 108 has done, wow, a, a massive old super chat. Um, saying, uh, thank you for introducing me to this game. I've completed it twice and I'm currently playing along with you. I haven't been watching your live stream so much as I've moved to Germany. Here, haben etwas Geld. Um, Dankeschön. <laughs> Um, you're very welcome for the introduction to the game. Thank you for the absolutely massive super chat, and well done completing this game twice. Because as you can see, I haven't finished it once yet. Um, oh, some of you actually threw your arms up. Oh, arms up, everybody! Woo! Not like in a, not like in a, I'm you're in trouble kind of way, but in like an I want to see your tattoos of Mary Poppins sort of way. Uh, Ty C has done a super chat saying LSP. You're an LSP, Ty C, and it's nice that you are. Oh, here, have this money. Oh, thanks. Good. Okay. Cool. That's what that, that means. Uh, all right. Apparently, Dankeschön was the appropriate response. Phew! Oh, man. Whisper, whisper, whisper. Show me your arms! Bollocks. Apps, fucking nonsense. Ugh. Okay. Next. Me oh, ho, ho, there he is. There he is. We're going to identify him. Fucking yes. Right. Main deck, gun deck, gun deck, gun deck, gun deck. Oh, 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 here it comes. Here it comes. Oh, it's the peg leg, it's the peg leg out the window. Wrong window. Or, oh, oh, wrong side of the ship. Great. Peg leg. Look at your lovely tattoo, Butman. Uh, not Duncan McKay, but, but, Timothy Butman, the Butman, who was shot by Nichols. Nichols, you piece of shit. Warmack, you piece of shit. Why am I not surprised? Nichols. That felt good. That felt good. <laughs> and we know who you are. We know who you are. Who else we got? Explodo Midshipman. Lars. 
Ba da 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 Oh, you weren't torn apart by a beast at all, look! You were spearhead! You weren't torn apart. Oh, yes you were. Oh, you just hadn't died yet. Damn, you had a rough day. And we know who all these folk are. Apart from you. You were speared by a beast. You were speared by a beast. How many memories have you been in? I know you, you perished in the calling part one. Yeah, you was, yeah, yeah, we, yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Bit of fun. Hello, chicken. Hello, pig. You exploded midshipman, you. I'm gonna, f I'm gonna find out who you, oops. Was, ex was blasted by an explosion, yes. Yes, yes. Ten memories. Location of the corpse. Main deck. Over there. Right. Eleanor Smith says, got a dash for dinner, catch the rest on VOD. Take care, Eleanor. Okay. All right. Now here's the thing, right? I know this one, we've had... We've definitely had a conversation about not being able to hold on. And some... We should know who this guy is. Now this one, 15 memories, pun perished in the bloody blah. Och, no, you cut. Tell Pete's mother I tried my best to pull him back to save him. We identified Pete before, I swear to God. That's Peter Milroy. Which is going to give us... Thomas Lanker. Who was shanked by an unknown attacker. Oh yeah, och, you cut. Och, no. We, we're going to be able to get this one. I bet you, because... Yeah, 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 yeah. Thomas... Uh, you died in the escape part six uh, on the gun deck down there. Right. Fucking get in there. Because you can trace this one back to before he was stabbed. You can absolutely trace that one back to before he was stabbed. I know you can. Knifey knifey room! We all remember knifey knifey room now, don't we? But, um. Oh, fucking yes! Oh, no! You're cut! Don't leave me. Bear up, son. I'll stay with you. Tell Pete's mother I, I, I tried my best. Aye. I'll be one of these, won't it? Anyway. You tell her yourself. Brennan! Bring the surgeon's kit! Right, 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 right. I could have just looked at the, um... I could have just looked at the, um... The, uh... The, uh... <laughs> the, uh <laughs> Help! The fucking transcript! But I didn't. Right, we want this one. 
Okay. He's already been niffed. Damn it. Dum dum da dum dum. Da da dum 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 dum. Da da dum 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 dum. So we won actually part four, I reckon. Ba dum. I feel like I should be able to remember this, but... WHO STABBED YOU?! Fresh bastard. Okay, that's how he died. I actually think it's going to be this one. It's going to be Leonid. I mean, it sounds like he was knifed by Fresh Bastard Man. Oh, that's... Vita. But I just want to be doubly, doubly sure. Pop on. Yes, 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 yes. It's all very, all very bad. Yes, yes, yes. Why, why, why? Well, well, well. If it isn't indeed, Olus and Thomas was shanked by Olus. Cool. All right. Okay, so where did we get to? I mean, so we galloped ahead, really, to try and find that tattoo. Timothy was shot with a gun gun. Who else was there? Anyone we haven't identified. I want to go have another look at Lars. That's what I want to do. Now that's interesting. That's very interesting. No, no, no. Ah, oh, fuck. Location of the corpse. Yeah, no, this is interesting now, because we happen to know one of the... Oh my god, if I get the Peters brothers now. Mm, one of the Peters brothers is a topman. Basically, they don't have the same rank aboard ship. Let's have a look. I know they're toward the end. Right, we've got Samuel Peters as a seaman and Uh-oh, was I wrong? No, Nathan P oh, Nathan Peters is a seaman. Damn it, they're both seamen. All right. Well, let's see what we get anyway. Hmm. Let me on. <laughs> Over my dead body. Over my dead bloody to dump a dark time. There's no cause for trouble, boys. Get in the boat. Thought I'd forget. You killed my brother. What? That was an accident. The robes. It wasn't his fault. I saw the whole thing. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, wait a fucking minute. 
You're one of the you're one of the brothers. Right? Crushed by cargo. Where's his fucking brother? I mean, not that one. Fucking is if brother. I think. Crushed cargo. That's the br their brothers. That's the Peter's brothers. <laughs> Peter's brothers. Okay. <laughs> it's the fucking brothers. It wasn't his fault. I saw the whole thing. Lies. I shouldn't have waited so long. Brothers, Peter's brothers. Right. Now, the question is, right, let's go back to Loose Cargo. Loose Cargo! Oi, wait, wait, no, down below. <sighs> oh, I was really hoping there'd be a bit more there. I'll tell you what we will do. A look at... Wait a minute. No, he was present. Bollocks. All right, we're going to go back. We're going to go back to the... Let's go back to the start again so we can be sure of who died. did a did did him. Sure of who died. did a did did him. That's not the one. Okay, all right. Brothers! Wait a fucking minute, wait a fucking minute, wait a fucking minute. This is the first guy to die. It's the first guy to die. Come on, come on. Okay, the Peter's numbers are 60. And 48. So if we go back to the hammock memory and either of those hammocks is occupied we know who's who it's a it feels like a bit of a long shot but i'm gonna stop i'm i'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna we'll see oh look uh no wait this is definitely not one of these Fifty-eight. No, it's not these ones. It's c come on, come on. Next birth, next birth, next birth. Fifty-three. No, we no, we've done these. <sighs> what were the numbers again? 60 and 60 and 48 58 57 55 
38. 59. Oh, that is tantalizing. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? 37. 42. Come on. 36. Fuck. Yeah. 59. I mean... Fifty-six, fifty-five, fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-one, fifty. 57, 58, 51, 50, we know all of these ones. Damn it. Nice, which says, time for me to dash, take care, Skellies, thanks for the stream, Johnny. Thank you so much for being here, Sarah. It's genuinely a fucking delight every time you're in chat. Uh, I hope you're very, very well. Oh, oh. Oh, that would have been so good. Tell me who you are, you little hammock bastards. Dum, dum, dum. Yeah, okay. So it's no good. No good. Doesn't help that I keep forgetting the numbers. 60 for Samuel. And... <laughs> for, is it 48 for Peters? I'm just going to make it triply sure. You can tell I've been playing for a while, and my brain's a bit fried. <sighs> now, here's... Mm, 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 mm. Let's move post-mortem. Let's try this one. Let's try the other one. Because we might be able to see different hammock. Let me out! No, nothing. <laughs> nothing. Okay. All right. Well, it was worth exploring that. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. <sighs> so. I wonder. I just want to have a look at some fucking hammocks. <laughs> uh, main deck. Yes, okay, alright. Well, it's worth a worth a crack. Let's have a look. I want to have a look at that one just to see if I can get a look at the hammocks. I think this will be my last exploration and then we'll knock it on the head for now. Can't get up there. Ah, uh, that was no, nah, that was optimistic. Optimistic at the very best. Signori Nicos. Okay. Woof. I mean there's a lot on the gun deck, isn't there? Soldier of the Sea, Unholy Captives, but... Ooh, the Doom Part 2 could do it. The Doom Part... Oh, no. Looks like we're going to have to listen to some shitting. Okay, last, last one. May as well close on the horrible shit noise. 
because I think this is a nighttime one. Oh, but the doom is like way far in, isn't it? <laughs> 43, 44. 48, 49 are empty. <laughs> it's so bad. 45. Yeah, the problem is loads of people are dead by this point. Yeah, it's not. 57, 56. Hang on. I've forgotten the numbers again. Let's have a look. Uh, so 60 and... Wait a minute, 48? Damn, it's empty! Ah! We don't even know when this guy dies. I mean, just because it's empty doesn't mean... Because a lot of these hammocks have been taken down. So his hammock is still up. Because at this point, it's not... So much. 48 is still strung up. I think you're 48. I think... I think you're Nathan. And I think this is your brother, Samuel. <laughs> oh, that feels good. Dom, dom, tum, 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 tum. Tom, Tom. <clears throat> oh, I mean, there's there's no better place to end than there, really, is there? Fucking yes! Okie dokie 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 dokie. And exactly on 8pm, as you, as you say, thank you so much, everyone, for sticking with me through this. It's been an absolute treasure, a, a delight. Um, I mean, we'll... I've, Serenity Moon 1976 has done a super sticker of the pair going like, oh, way, as if to say, well done. Thank you very much. Um, oh, that felt so good. Are we gonna, obviously, we're going to play this again. I'm back streaming on uh, Monday, and I, for the time being, I'm going to keep streaming video games rather than painting, um, just while I get my head sorted. At the minute, I'm finding talking and painting and streaming all a little bit difficult, so... Um, I'm going to revert to just doing video game streams. <laughs> I'm also going to sneeze on my own chest. Um, and yeah, I'll be back then. Um, also on Saturday, there'll be fresh episodes of Preston Kiadini. Thank you so much for sticking with me on this stream. Um, I do have a Patreon. It's patreon.com forward slash Johnny Kiadini. If you want to check that out, there's a link in the description of this video and also a link in chat if you can and uh, are able uh, and willing to support me through that. It's really, really great because it means I keep... Uh, I get to keep doing this as a job, but also your support here on YouTube is invaluable. Like, thank you so much for being here and watching and chatting and super chatting and liking the stream, etc., etc. Uh, please tell your friends about this channel because it would be nice to to um to to make some more lovely skelly pals, which makes it sound like I'm flaying the flesh on people's bones and reanimating their skeletons. That is not what I am doing. I am not a necromancer, um, but I am very much in love with you all. So uh, have a lovely rest of your day. I will see you very soon. Take care and thank you again for watching. Bye! Oh, I made the thanks for watching screen saying insurance claim filed because I assumed that we'd have finished the game today. But we haven't, look. So, insurance claim not filed!
not filed. Bye, everyone.